In the big wide world of Paltea, there might be too many things to do. Well, luckily for you, Jen, I'm alive. Friend, I promise. All right. Song for you. Game it. Sorry, I just got back from the gas station. The song I, like I have a bag. It's uh, I currently have a bag of bold Chex Mix. Basically, it's savory Chex Mix. And a can of Mountain Dew, I'm ready to shit bricks. Uh, no. Hello, everybody. Open world to peep into your cloister. Sorry it took so long. Uh, how long? 13 minutes? Okay, actually, I made record time. I'm actually impressed. The fact that I was actually able to fucking book it to the gas station, get snacks, and come back at a reasonable time is, uh, impressive, considering I usually don't, uh, get I usually don't do shit on time, but how's it going, everybody? Hopefully everybody's doing good. I know I am, and welcome to the stream on the 22nd of March, 2024. And to all of my members of the, I think it's the front row ticket, and higher, enjoy the first episode of the brand new Let's Play that's going to be launching for everybody else on Tuesday. I'm very happy. <laughs> I'm very happy. It's, it's done. We've done it. Ah. <sighs> I'm so happy that it that we're actually starting a Let's Play again. Also, happy Princess Peach Showtime launch day to all of the people. Chat, okay, how come no one... Okay, I was going to make the analogy that Princess Peach Showtime, when I played the demo, it had a lot of Kirby's Epic Yarn vibes. You know, you know Kirby's Epic Yarn? Like, one of the most, like, you know, one of the best Wii games ever made. It's, it's one of my favorite games, and I think... The reason I wanted to compare it so much to, to uh, Princess Peach Showtime, the reason I wanted to compare it to uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn is because it is a very simplistic game, two buttons, transformations, and some collectibles every now and then, but it's a very charming game and that's like 
the most part. It's just supposed to be a game you vibe to, which a lot of people could also say like, Spyro. Casually playing Spyro is a very simple game. I would know. I did a full let's play of it, and 100%ing it was still a vibe. Still a vibe and a half. What's up, Rock Polish? So, it is, uh, yeah, ow. Ow. My hair is long, and sometimes when I comb through it, it has like a million knots in it. But, okay, so chat, I want to, I'm going to double check my info before I start spreading misinformation on the internet. Uh, Princess Peach Showtime Devs. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. So chat, do you know who made Kirby's Epic Yarn? Do you know who, who made Kirby's Epic Yarn chat? It's a developer uh, known as Goodfeel Games. And I wondered why I was feeling similar feelings to Kirby's Epic Yarn. You know, Yoshi's Woolly World is also made by Goodfeel. Yoshi's Crafted World, which is more divisive amongst the fan base, but it also made by Goodfeel. Uh, do you want to guess who also made Princess Peach Showtime? <laughs> Princess Peach Showtime. I can't believe no one has fucking said this, or at least it's, it's the fact that no one has made the comparison or at least like has made a big deal that it was made by Goodfeel, the same developer of Kirby's Epic Yarn. The same people who made Kirby's Epic Yarn made Princess Peach Showtime. And I was about to make an analogy being like, oh, this game is like Kirby's Epic Yarn with how like, yeah, it's an easy game, but it's a really fun game and it's a very pleasant game and it's a very, you know, just a good time. It has a good feel to it. It's made by the same fucking people. <laughs> Anyways, enough mic peeking for the night. Uh, well, who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? Because chat, welcome to the Bug Fables finale stream. We are going to marathon. We are going to marathon Bug Fables. So for those that have not checked out the stream on Wednesday, check it out. It's the uh, 11th stream. So we did this in 12 streams. 12 fucking streams. I guess Goodfeel is Nintendo's go-to for, hey, we need someone to make an easy game crew. It's more or less, yeah, it is an easy game, but I feel like it's more of a, we need a vibes game. I, I think calling it an easy game kind of puts it in a negative light to a lot of people. So when, I, when I've when i been talking about Princess Peach Showtime, I try to not call it an easy game. I know exactly what you meant. I know you weren't trying to, I need to, I need to put the music down. You'd think I'd get used to this, but no. Yeah, so I found out that apparently Goodfeel made Princess Peach Showtime. And um, and um, yeah. What's up, the dude? He was here. Yeah, well, say everybody say hello to the dude. The dude joined us on Wednesday. He joined us on Wednesday. I, he, they, I don't, I don't know what it is. Let me know uh, if, you know, because I, I would like to, I would like to know. Uh, you know, I don't want to, like, misgender you and that, like, you know, be uncomfortable for you. But basically, uh, yeah, dude joined us. So j dude, the deed, he knows what's up. Uh, Wednesday, we made it. We finally beat the poison build. We finally have a build in Bug Fables that isn't the Poison build, the build that has carried us for the entire game. We have respect. we have tried a brand new build, it is a do-nothing build. I think people call it the Senator Armstrong build, because I'm a dude. Well, yeah. I mean, dude, I feel like dude could be gender neutral, you never know. Also, here's the new, I think Doodle made this, brand new animation. I just find it cute, and I think it's, I think it's always funny to put dudes, or put doodles uh, I, I think it's always funny to put doodles and in, in <laughs> animations in the in the fan art slideshow and have peep have the people just don't fucking know what it is. Kabu is finally off drugs. The finale stream we're going to be using the brand new do nothing build. We're going to do the Senator Armstrong build. In Bug Fables, we have done every side quest that is available before stepping foot on Rubber Prison. Once we step on Rubber Prison, we're we're going to be playing this game from stepping on Rubber Prison. To the end of the game entirely. I don't care if this is a, a three hour stream, a two hour stream, a six hour stream. I don't care. If we have to do another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet credit stream, it's gonna happen. And then in a few months, we'll probably do the. Here's the thing, chat. In two days is the two year anniversary of Kerbazoid since the first video that came out, March 24th, 2022, was the first video of Kerbazoid. So chat, I'm going to finish this fucking video game before we turn two years old. 
All of us were all turning collectively two years old in two days. I'm happy for all the Pikmin songs. I just feel like I think me and everyone else, I think we deserve a, a calmer soundtrack. I, th I just like the calmer soundtrack. I'm not a, you know, I think just for the simple sake of it, I forgot how quiet the Pikmin soundtrack was. So apologies if it's like really quiet. But, um, yeah. Bit Bug Fables. We're going to be playing Bug Fables all the way to the very end. Um, Rock Polish, correct me if I'm... Uh, so, I guess before we go into anything, Rock Polish, I have some questions for you. My my good friend, Rock Polish, uh, some, you're basically the Dr. Narwhal of the Bug Fables streams. I have some questions. Question one. Will, will there be any more side quests popping up after we beat Chapter 6, Rever Prison, and then going into the end game? It, will there be more side quests? And then, I guess just ballpark guess. I know you're not like the end-all be-all when it comes to Bug Fables knowledge, but by your best estimate of the fact that we've basically been like... We have, we have pretty much been bowling through the game. There will be a few more. All right. Genuinely, how many hours do you think we have left? Because I firmly believe that we have not had a, had a genuine challenge if I'm actually, like, you know, locked in and I, and I, I, you know, I'm not making mistakes. I think for the most part, most bosses have been absolutely nothing. I think most bosses, even on hard mode, we are max level, we have a really good badge setup. I don't think the bosses are going to take too long. Maybe that's, maybe that's going to be poorly aged in a few hours, I don't know. But I don't know. I can't wait for our collective birthday. I gotta make something. Yeah. But in general, chat, I think I forget. Am I doing... I think I've been doing YouTube for five years? Or I'm going on my fifth year now? I think it is. Like three-ish, maybe? If we are actually trying to go through the game quick. Hmm. Alright. We're gonna get all the spy cards. Get the last of the spy cards. Do all of the bosses. I'm just saying, I don't think we're gonna be... Maybe we'll take our time. If it's three hours, we'll do it. We'll do it. So probably at latest, we'll see. Okay, if we have time, we will do the post game. I'm not going to promise we'll do the post game. It's probably going to be a, hey, let's take a break. Let the game breathe for a bit. Get started. You know, get kind of in the groove with, um, get in the groove with Citizen Sleeper, you know? And then, why are you a bug? Uh, because this is the, uh, I just like drawing, I like drawing PNG tubers that match the games we're playing. So I tried to, this is like the little mantis curb that I have for the Bug Fable streams. I just didn't do it on Wednesday because it wasn't a main Bug Fable stream, I guess. There are two post-game bosses, by the way, just telling you for future reference. Okay. Hmm. We might, we might do a post-game stream separate from itself on a Monday or Wednesday. But I want to get started. I, one, I want this to be, I want to see the credits before the, the two-year anniversary. But second, I want to, uh, I don't know, I want to give that game some breathing room before I do the post-game to kind of like let the end of Bug Fables kind of like sink in for me and you guys, so. But we will do the post-game at some point. It's like similar to Skylanders, well, okay. Skylanders Giants, I've said it, as like, if I am able to succeed and get an apartment and get a stable internet connection uh, by summer of 2024, I will str I will drop everything I'm doing, even the let's play I'm doing right now, or drop the stream things. We'll probably chat. Would you rather me stream Skylanders Giants? I think people would rather me stream Skylanders Giants instead of doing a let's play on it, since I'm currently in the process of doing a let's play that's going to launch Tuesday, 5 p.m. CST. I don't know if I should say it. All right, for those that are watching the stream, fuck it. Um, it's Cult of the Lam Cult of the Lamb. We're gonna play Cult of the Lamb, and it is a full. I'm like RPing as a cultist. I'm R I'm doing a whole like narrative around the whole point of my character playing the game. And there's gonna be bumpers. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be great. I'm very excited. It's gonna be very experimental, but I think it's gonna be a nice little twist on the let's play genre that I think you guys are gonna enjoy. Um. It's been fun doing it. It's, it I, it's a lot more fun to edit a let's play where I'm playing a different character instead of me just kind of watching me stumble through my thoughts and emotions. When's the Binding of Isaac? Eh. Streaming would be more fun. I think so too. Reed is, Reed is happy you're playing Cult of the Lamb. It's gonna happen. 
it's gonna happen. You're gonna- the first episode, it's- the first few episodes are gonna be tutorial hell. Um, that's just how it is. Uh, but for every video, once it's done, like literally as soon as it is finished, I will schedule it for regular people, but as soon as the video is done, instead of waiting for like the scheduled time, which will probably which will probably be Tuesdays at 5 p.m. CST, uh, members, YouTube YouTube members of the three dollar tier or higher, they will be able to to get it for like immediately. As soon as it's finished, they'll get it. So that's if that incentivizes anybody to to support the channel through memberships, that's more than fine. We even have a one dollar tier if that's more your thing and you just want to like support however you can you're watching you're watching the video you're fine but yeah but yeah binding of isaac is kicking my rear <laughs> uh binding of isaac well, one of these days one of these days yeah i think we will yeah i think we're gonna stream we will we will just drop citizen sleeper immediately and we will stream skylanders giants if if i can if i can succeed if not then we will save that for when I come back to streaming. I think that's what it is. Regardless, I think be I want this game because it's $25 for a good game. That's less That's less than every Nintendo game ever. Yeah, this is a quality video game, and it's on sale, like, all the time. So that's the best part about uh, games not made by Nintendo. They're on sale, like, all the time. Mmm. That was a good crisp opening of the month on You know, when I was at my church's youth group when I was a kid during high school, I had such a, uh, I had such an addiction to Mountain Dew, and still kind of do. I don't drink it every day, but it's like if I have a soda, and I want something with a lot of flavor, this is the one I go to. It's my comfort soda, because I've had it ever since I was really young. I was the Mountain Dew kid, and one day, uh, we were, we were like hanging out at like a Michael's, and then we went to a Kohl's, our youth group, because we were making blankets, and we wanted to do stuff where, where like we made blankets out of like a bunch of shirts, made blankets out of like some cloth. I bought a Mountain Dew shirt, and I wore it immediately, and yeah, I was known as the Mountain Dew kid in my youth group. I don't know what that says. What, what does that mean for someone if they're like the Mountain Dew kid at a church youth group? Chad, how would you profile me now that you, how, like, did, how, what is that, what is that, uh, what, how does this greatly uh, change your opinion on me now that I have shared such uh, sensitive information? I have an addiction to drinking anything I can find, even paint. Hmm. All right. That makes me feel a little better. I'll take it. All right. It's time. Oh, wait, here. Wait, one second. I'm not going to lie, chat. Ever since, for the past few weeks, I've been so depressed about the whole summer thing. I have been so depressed about that because I don't want to stop. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't want to stop something I've been working on for going on five years now. I don't. I really don't. <laughs> fun fact, YouTube is fun, and I like streaming. I like being an insp a creative inspiration for people. I like being entertaining for people. I, I like doing funny voices on the internet. It's fun. I like it. It's it's amazing. But uh, being realistic, that can happen where I will have to. It's not ending it, but it's taking a break until I have the means to do it again. And kind of realizing that, you know, there's two ways to look at it of it being like, oh, it's so over. You know, there's a chance this could fail. So I'm not going to like get too involved anymore just in case it, you know, it fails and I have like nothing. But then there's the part of me that's like, oh, well, if I'm going to take a break for a while, then let's fucking like, you know, live every day like it's your last brother, you know? Ah, that's just kind of the mentality. So I hope to, I, I don't know, re like today, I am, I'm feeling great. I had a hard day at work. I cleaned 11 hotel rooms and they were all inhabited by fucking slobs. But I did it. But I fucking did it. I cleaned 11 dirty-ass hotel rooms. I dug in shower drains with my, well, not bare hands, with a rag and some gloves and a lot of chemicals. I fucking cut, it looked like I, like, slit like a, like a dent, like a, like I put, like, a little hole into my arm. I don't know how, but, like, yeah. 
I cut myself, not on purpose, mind you, I'm not, not that, uh, but like I accidentally cut myself during work. It's just, man, I'm feeling great. I passed a milestone in my savings account, you know, I'm, I feel a little more comfortable about moving out. And if I gotta move, whatever, whatever. I'm trying my best to, to be positive about it. And finally, you know, feeling some form of change, because this is gonna be big change. Because this is like the main thing I've been streaming. <laughs> oh god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> the Mountain Dew fought back and wanted to escape. Um, This is a big change, because we're finishing something I've been working on for three months now. And it is a lot of change, but you know what? I am ready for change to happen. Also, Chad, I got a, I got an email. I got an email recently uh, about like a microphone company. I'm not going to say where they are, but it's like, hi, Kerbazoid. I hope this message finds you well. Uh, we are one of the, we're, you know, we have audio products. Your videos are amazing. I, I haven't made a video since January. I stream, so I don't know what they're talking about. Uh, your videos are amazing, and we are, and we're, and were, uh, W-E-R-E, -E, no apostrophe, were, and we were wondering if you would be interested in joining the Talent Moment program. We will send you a handmade pro microphone. Other expenses are not covered. And in return, you would showcase something interesting in a video using this microphone as your recording tool. You can find information about our successful collaborators and inquire about their experiences. Okay, here's the thing. That's actually really cool. They're like, hey man, we're going to be transparent. Uh, we're going to give you a microphone. I think other expenses not covered. I think they just mean like it's a pro microphone, so it's an XLR microphone, so you need an audio interface for that. That's fine. I don't mind having an audio interface. I just don't have the headphones to support that. Which is... Bleh. Bleh. But yeah, they were just like, hey man, we'll just straight up give you a microphone. Uh, yeah. And then in bold text, it would be a win-win arrangement if you happen to require a professional microphone for your recording, don't you think? I feel like that's just targeted. What? Why are you playing the wrong bug game? What wrong bug game? <laughs> well, like, uh, I was gonna say, there's other bug games. I mean, there's Deep Rock Galactic, there's Helldivers 2. I do want to play Helldivers 2 with my friends. That'd be fun. Or, you know, there's bug games like Starfield. <laughs> okay, wait, chat, did you see? I'm not going to talk much about it because I, I'm i not going to pretend. I'm not going to pretend like I fully understand the situation. So take everything I say with a grain of salt. Chat, did you see the uh, Dragon's Dogma 2 thing that happened? So Dragon's Dogma 2, a Pikmin Fables. Oh, I see. I see. I can play Deep Rock now. Nice, Eli, nice. Um, did you guys see that Dragon's Dogma 2? Apparently in Dragon's Dogma 2, uh, which apparently critics fucking love this game. It's been a very hyped game by Capcom. Have you guys seen the in-app, like the in-game purchases for that game? How you can pay like $1.50 to get yourself out of jail? And it's like a bunch of microtransactions? And the game doesn't have fast travel. <laughs> The game doesn't have fast travel, apparently. Again, I don't know if it does. But apparently Dragon's Dogma 2 has no fast travel. And it has, like, a bunch of things where it's like, Oh, it's, like, a little annoying. It's a little annoying. And, like, its Steam page is flooded with microtransactions. Here, chat, chat. Actually, chat, 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 chat. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna see if I can find the Steam page. I hope Pikmin 2 will be a choice for streaming someday. Hey. Maybe, maybe. Uh, where is it? Dragon's Dogma 2? Is Dragon's Dogma 2 not on Steam? It Wait, is it not on Steam anymore? Hmm? Why are the unfiltered? Wait, what the fuck? Where's Dragon's Dogma? Where's Dragon's Dogma 2? Is Dragon's Dogma 2 not on Steam? Wait, chat, is it not on Steam? I never played Pikmin? It's fun. It's a good time. Uh, Chat, I could have sworn it came out recently, didn't it? 
Did it get taken down from Steam? Wait. What the hell? Wait. No, wait. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. Dragons. Dogma 2. Steam. Why was this not showing up on my fucking... Why did it not show up? Okay. Uh, guy, I gotta put in my birthday. The game's too graphic. The game's too graphic, chat. Okay, for one thing. Okay, well, it's getting more mixed reviews. But a few hours ago, Dragon's Dogma 2 was overwhelmingly negative on the all reviews. I think it was only, it was only like 33% positive, I think. It was like very negative. Let me see. Holy shit. Okay, yeah. 21. Oh my god. 21 separate DLC purchases. Holy shit. There's 21 different, like, miniature, like, less than a dollar DLC purchases. And, like, all of them are, like, yeah, Art of Metamorphosis Character Creator. What the fuck is this? All of the- like, there's just so much shit in. There's no- like, I don't get why. Yeah, 21 separate DLCs, and basically it's like, Hey, are you tired of playing this monotonous part of the video game? Give us three dollars, and we can make that tedious grinding magically disappear. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Dragon's Dogma 2, Wakestone, restore the dead to life. Dragon's Dogma 2, Wakestone, restore the dead back to life. Uh, points to spend beyond the rift. Yeah, it gives you rift crystals, which are a currency. The Thousand Year Door is coming out May 24th. Oh, nice. Warp location marker, which I think, wait, open a port crystal, which can be set as a destination of your choice. Use a fairy stone to instantly transport your party. Oh, so you can pay $3 in real money in your 70, oh, no, no, no. Yeah, in your $70 video game, you can spend $3, three extra dollars to get an extra fast travel point. You wish you could see the face I'm making. Oh, hey, here we are. Uh, Dragon's Dogma 2, Art of Metamorphosis Character Editor. Obtain an item that allows the Arisen to edit their own appearance. You can spend an extra $2 in a $70 video game to change your character's appearance. Which, for the most part, is a free fucking feature, which should be a feature in the fucking $70 video game. Overall, it has 85 mostly negative reviews. Who would have thought? Uh, oh, there's a key? Yeah, okay, here's one. Obtain a key to the Gowl. Of relatively crude made will break after a sing single use. So for, for $1 in your $70 video game, you can pay money to leave jail, which is a feature in the game where you go to jail if you do a bad thing. Wow, who would have thought? <laughs> Basic, okay, you know how like people were like super mad at Assassin's Creed? For, um, you know how people were mad at Assassin's Creed for basically doing, like, uh, when it became an RPG, it would sell EXP boosters? That's the same shit. You're spending $70 on what should be a complete video game that should be an enjoyable experience. But then it's offering you to spend even more money outside of the 70 US dollars that you're spending on the video game to make the $70 video game quicker to enjoy and more enjoyable. If you need to offer, if you need to offer, yeah, it's it's pay to win. You're paying to win in a single player $70 RPG. And people are, and here's the thing, people are like, oh, but, but you guys complaining, it's optional. It's optional, you can do it. That doesn't matter. If they needed to add DLC, here's the thing. Why would they put the DLC in there if that mechanic isn't like... Here's the thing. <laughs> okay, here's my, here's my problem. Here is my problem with this idea. The reason they're doing it in the fucking first place is probably... You don't offer that as a shortcut, a paid shortcut, if that is something that players can find tedious. 
that's basically you warning players on your own fucking Steam page that that is something that will be tedious in the game, so you should consider spending a dollar on it. It's fucking stupid! It's fucking stupid! It's a $70 video game. It's fucking $70! You should not have that. I'm so confused at that. Mm. Like why? Just like genuinely why? It's it's Ubisoft. It's fucking I know it I, I know it's not Ubisoft, but it's Capcom trying to pull a fucking Ubisoft. It that's what it is. And it's so disappointing because I know a lot of people that were really excited to play this game if they still enjoy the game without paying the microtransactions and it's still an enjoyable game without the microtransactions. Let's fucking go. It's a win. But you know if they can, they, but you know that they know that if they can get away with doing that shit, they can get away with more. Or they can attempt to put more. That's the problem, is that if, God, that's the fucking problem with this shit. It's just like, oh, you know, people are letting it slide that we are slowly drip feeding extra DLC pull shit to make the game easier even though it's a $70 video game and I should have no inclination to pay DLC even if it's cheap as shit. I don't care. It's a $70 video game. The game should be fun without microtransactions and it should like without the microtransactions even having to be there in the first place. The problem is if we tolerate it now, it's going to get fucking worse. Like Capcom will be like, oh, this is a, this is a sign. We can do this. Okay, we're allowed to do this now. Let's play Bug Fables, a twenty dollar video game that in no way requires you to pay any money for it, pay pay any extra money for it. Let's say. <sighs> I don't understand that shit, chat. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be dead ass honest. I don't. I think anybody like that has been raised in the PS2. Xbox, you know, that era. It's so, and even like the PS3, Xbox 360, Wii era, no matter which console you had, or like even if you had a PC at the time, I think we can all agree that th this is not the only example. This is the weakest example, like comparing it to like, uh, I don't know. I just don't get it. Like, I feel like simple by simply adding that shit, to the DLC, the only money we need to pay in Bug Fables was for Kabu's drug usage, yeah. Exactly. We would have more money if we weren't committing so hard to the poison build, or if I didn't realize the the build for uh, doing nothing was really good. But I think we didn't really get much of that until, like, way later in the game. I don't know, chat. I'm fucking pissed at that, and I don't even- I'm not even gonna play the game. I didn't even want to play the game. I'm angry for people. <laughs> I'm angry because, like, here's the thing. I like Capcom. I played some Street Fighter 6. I had a good time. I like uh, Mega Man. Uh, I liked Mega. I liked Mega Man X1. That was a good game. I played. <laughs> what was that on the SNES? <laughs> you know, it's like I, Capcom is a series that I'm so like. I liked Marvel vs. Capcom too. That was a fun game. I wasn't good at it, but I, I liked it. It was cool. You know, take me for a ride. You know, it's just it is just a fucking shame because. It's just, it's so fucking stupid. It, the only reason that they're doing this is just so that they can try to see if they can get away with it. Because they already fucking swindled $70 off of you. Let's see if we can swindle in a few extra bucks along the way. It's like an extra 15, if you bought all of that, like that optional shit, that DLC, it's $15. That would be bare minimum 85 US dollars for that and all that DLC. It is not worth that. There's no way that's worth that. I don't know. Hey, Bug Curb, what's up, Slouch? It's been a while, Slouch. I hope you're doing good. Also, Slouch, with you being one of the members, uh, welcome. I hope you're enjoying the uh, the new LP. Are you guys talking about Dragon's Dogma 2? Yeah. I found out about that shit like an hour ago. Shit's bizarre. I was one day off, it's 23- oh, the 23rd for Thousand Year Door. Nice. Hmm. 
Yeah, no, it's just, that's just fucking stupid. It's the thing, it's like, everybody's like, you don't have to buy it. But it's like, we're not complaining about buying it. We're complaining about the idea that they think we're fucking stupid enough to buy it. I'm gonna go to Target with my mom? Oh. Make sure to grab me some, uh, some Pringles. I'm out. Get some pizza Pringles, those are my favorite. Anyway, uh, Bug Fibble. Let's forget about the woes of the world for one goddamn second. And let's play some Bug Fables. This is the finale we finally reached. Not only we are the max level, we are the highest level in the game, rank 27, and we have 40 hours clocked into this fucking game, dude. Sorry for not participating in the stream more. I moved in this week. Whoa! Hey, no, 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 no! Do not apologize. That's cool. I hope the move went well, and I hope you're doing good, Slouch. Don't you dare. Don't you dare apologize for, for moving. <laughs> Stop it. No. No complaining. No, no apologizing. I always say it. I, I never require anybody. Not a single soul. I do not require anybody to stay here for every single stream. Except for Eli, because... He needs to commit to the bit at this point, otherwise I'm very disappointed. Rubber Prison. It's the end game! Woo. We made it. I trust the termites, but I'm glad to leave the submarine. Your fears aside, could you tell us a bit more about Rubber Prison? This is new to us. Oh, I know this one. It's the prison where they put all the bad bugs. Things got that bad after Elizant went to sleep. So it seems. It's quite the secure facility, yes? The wasps taking over is quite troublesome. Nah, we'll just snoop around and beat them up. It's what we do. Heh, <laughs> that's a good plan. Let's go, team. We must clear the way for the others. Okay. Ooh. I'm gaming. I'm gaming right now. Uh, yeah, we are. I guess we are the top level. Um, I, I'm gonna... Just for the simple fact, chat, and if we see a new character, we will we will we will fight them. But I I don't want to backtrack and get food again. I'm fine. The prison the prison's gates are all controlled by the gray switches. Please ask management for access to prevent getting trapped inside. Oh no! Wait. No, the convenient black gap in the floor. I can't dig past the black gap. Can't do it. Cryptozoid, hi! What's up, crypt uh, Crypto Coder? Hello. I've been good for the most part. Been open way into risk of rain. We are currently playing Bug Fables. We are at the finale of Bug Fables. I am not stopping the- this stream does not turn off until I get to see credits. That's just how it is. That's just how it works. So many bridges! This prison is huge! Are there truly so many wicked in Bulgaria? Well, if they're all here, we would n we wouldn't notice shit. <laughs> Can I dig under? Wait, I can't dig on this floor. Wait, yeah, I can't. Hmm, Sky Leo, how you doing? Did I get raided? What's going on? There's a lot of new people today. I'm not against it by any means. Wait. <gasps> I get it. We do that. Whoop. And then we would, I'm assuming, maybe? Hmm. Oh, I guess I could have done this too. Whoop. I feel like I'm supposed to hover. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Everything is controlled by the gray switches, right? No. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Not one, not two, three gates. It's a prison, what do you expect? Being an upstanding citizen has its perks. Might loathe to be imprisoned here. Okay. That is fair. Understand a brute. Am I supposed to do something? Oh, that's cool. Am I supposed? Hmm. Somehow I'm supposed to. 
be able to enter that, but I'm not sure how. Should I just tell you what you should do here? Give me a few more minutes. Because I think I can figure it out. Maybe... No. Hmm. I don't want to get answers this early on in the stream. I don't want... Uh, uh, but you probably have such useful information. <laughs> information that could help me. Can I... Oh, wait. Is the... I can't. Okay, so I can in the what? Interesting. Hmm... Oh, oh, we're learning speedrun strats, chat. Wait, Ayo, wait, can I? Oh, easy. I've played this game too long. Oh, let's go. I got it. I did something and it worked. Okay, I can't freeze those. I did it. I don't think I did it on purpose, but... All right, so I'm assuming the yellow, that's where we are. This is where all the gray switches are. Ah, okay, so the green indicates where a red, a green switch is. All right. And then red, I'm assuming, is the house. We have to get there. Interesting. All right, well, we've seen you before. We're max level. We don't, we don't give, we don't give no shits. Only authorized ant personnel allowed. Please provide ID. Oh, nice. Explorer's permit works. Nice. Explorers and visitors, do not lose your permit. Otherwise, you must. Uh, we must assume you are a prisoner. Have a good day. That's fair. You know what? That's that's true. All right. Oh, this is cool. This is a neat dungeon. Has a unique. Has a unique concept to it. I think it's cute. I think it's cute, chat. Hmm. What can I use to... Is there anything I want? No. Oh, does this keep me from... Uh, no? Why is that there? Interesting. Okay. Let's get a lay of the land, shall we? Oh, first of all, How's the stream been? We just started Bug Fables. I've been talking about, like, Princess Peach Showtime. Uh, okay, Slouch, did you know that Princess Peach Showtime was made by the same people that made uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn? And that might be why I, why I do kind of enjoy it. Hovering cages? Even for criminals, isn't that a bit excessive? We don't want to think about what, must, what one must do to earn such a cell. Good thing I can fly. up here uh, come on oh wait oh. oh I don't think I was supposed to <laughs> that doesn't feel like that how I was supposed to do it but I that's how I did it again I feel like I'm going by like the fucking skin of my teeth doing this Ayo. are you gonna stream Peach's Showtime uh I might do Princess Peach's Showtime for Sleepazoid that is the idea I don't think I- I just don't think I have the time to do Showtime, unfortunately. Is there a reason why I want to- Is there a reason I would want to go up here? Did I just skip- did I skip the puzzle? I'm confused. Um, yeah, if anybody doesn't know, I, I'm doing a sleep aid channel. That's my current, uh, side project. It's basically the cur- you know, if you want to, like, simplify it, I guess the idea of it. It's basically the Kerbacast for this year. And it is a sleep aid channel where I provide calm gameplay without commentary, except for like an opening monologue. And it's good. I, I really enjoy it. I think Princess Peach Showtime would be a good candidate for something like that. Oh boy. I, I, I'm very excited to see if Sleepazoid actually maintains its own unique audience. I think that would be cool. <gasps> I think... Ooh, I'm going to turn off sh uh, Bug Me Not just in case. Mm. 
being here makes me so uneasy. Why? It's not like someone like you would ever end up behind bars. Just from the idea of it. Alright. Let's dig down. I think they're gonna fight. Yeah. New enemy! We're gonna beat up an him. Ooh. Oh no. I don't like that. Beep, beep, beep. Unbelievable. Uh-oh. I've seen this guy in a wanted poster. He's super dangerous. He's flailing that chain like it's a leaf. Watch out for those kicks. Okay, so he's gonna very high attack kind of kind of scenario. Unbelievable. Oh, we won't know if they're weak to ice or not. <laughs> I I can assume they are, but still. Okay, this is the new strat. We have taunt, and then we have two stacks of all of. Oh no, we have two stacks of healing, do nothing, and defense do nothing so basically we get the same bonuses as uh we get to heal four hp every turn and we get an extra two defense every turn so basically this is the poison build but we don't have to use items it's quite nice actually do you have to watch sleepazoid as a sleep aid because it's fun to just watch a no commentary playthrough hey yeah no 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 okay so sleepazoid is not like the intent of it is to it's like I'm not gonna tell you how to fucking watch YouTube. If you just want to watch a commentaryless long play, that's just of calm video games. Like it is a calm game focused long play channel, but it's like or its intent is to be like, hey, it's 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 selling value. It's selling point, I guess, is blank hours of video game to fall asleep to. That is the that is the simple idea. I'm not gonna tell you how to watch my content, but uh oh, we can do that. Numbing bite. Oh, he didn't even get numbed. Okay, wait. <laughs> oh, this guy's easy as fuck. Yeah, see, we have we we don't get we don't take any damage to these guys. And Kabu, Kabu is like tw more than twice the HP. He is basically twice the HP as Leaf and V. I'm so happy with this with this build, man. It's such a good build. I love it so much. All right. So here's here's what we do now. We use a power-up relay to give Leaf the two, and then we use that to do a shit ton of damage. We did like six damage that turn. We're gonna give that turn relay to Kabu. So then Kabu can do nothing and taunt. I love this. I love this. Change ribbons. Oh! <gasps> That's really cool. That's really cool that you're able to do that. I didn't know that you could do that. Whoa, you can change ribbons on the fly? No one told me that. That is kind of like a weird, like, uh, it, that, that is kind of a, like, uh, a little nod to the partner swap mechanic in Paper Mario games. It, it, kind of, of it being like, hey, change your move set overall for a little... But you have to use up your turn. I like that. It's like a pseudo nod, but it's also just a gameplay mechanic. I'm not going to say it's like, you know, it's like how everybody hearing jazz is like, it's Persona 5. <laughs> oh my God. Persona 5. That's really cool. Forgot to mention the change of your things. Hey, no, I'm happy that I learned that shit organically. Like, don't worry about, like, oh, Captain, get to know about this. Hey, I learned that shit organically. I love that. I like that, you know, you're allowing me to experience this game organically for the most part. I appreciate it. I appreciate your patience with me. It, It's good. It's good. Me like. Me like. It's fun. It's fun figuring out this shit for myself. Even if at the end of the day it shows I'm a big fucking idiot, I'm learning. You know? That's all I care about. Alright. Hey, nice. Oh, is that a defense down, or is that a... I think that's a defense down? Alright, well, that doesn't... that doesn't matter. Alright. Give it to Leaf. Yeah, with our current build, Leaf's base attack does 7 base damage. That shit is insane, dude. Nice. Ruffian. Alright, uh... Put Bug Me Not back on... Hmm. 
Oh yeah, I for yeah. So we we showed that where basically if you oh we're going to, have to do some man this is like an ultimate test of our platforming or of our puzzle capabilities. Man, I'm so happy about that. I'm so happy that this game does really lean into the, uh, I'm a bigoty too, let's go, <laughs> curb pog. Cafeteria giant, Giant's Lair Bridge. All right. Oh, Venus, no! Wait, we have to get Venus. I'm assuming if we close this and then... That opens Venus. Yay, what's up, Venus? What's up, girl? Uh, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. I'ma sip the Mountain Dew. Mm. We're gonna be in it for the long run, chat, so... Mmm, I see. Eh, no. So we use the brand new hover ability. Man, I'm so happy that this game does, uh, it does heavily lean on the puzzle platforming side. That makes me very happy. Because it's good. I think this game, it, like, excels when it comes to the puzzle platforming. Especially when it comes to the unique way that they tackle scenarios. But that's just me. I think it's just good. Alright, so that door's closed. That opened some... Or it got some form of mechanism in order. We need to get a key for that. Alright. Let's keep going. Yeah, I would say one of, like, my biggest uh, pluses for this game is that it definitely... Like, the dungeons in this game are really fun. I really like it. Oh, that's generic NPC! Wait, there, it is, there he is. Cafeteria cells, gym, security, giant slayer bridge. All right. Hmm. I want to talk to these guys. Wait, no. I want to talk to you. You put us here, so don't expect us to be happy to see you. Look, we're waiting for this to blow over. Let us be. Well, at least they're serving their sentence dutifully. You know, that's all you can ask for. In these trying times. Ooh, wait. Could I not? Yeah, nice. Ayo. Now, what did that do? Oh, oh God. All right. No, come on. There we are. My sentence is over in two days. No, I am escaping now. Go away. History book. A red book in the rubber prison. It says, although it hasn't been found, many explore looking for it in the name of the Ant Queen. Is that a different form of the lore book? Interesting. Interesting. What's up, angry artist? What is it like furiously scribbling on, on an empty page? How does that go? Oh, no, thank you. No, thank you. I'm good. Uh, let's go here. So that way we can get the bread. Let's get that bread. We need to call MatPat for this? Uh oh. Fair. I didn't think about it like that. Dry bread. Let's go. Thorny floors and poor eating conditions. It truly is hell on earth. Oh, please don't drop me. Shit. I did get a key, right? I won't explain what those books are, but you'll figure it out soon enough. Alright, I was about to say, is it like a... It might be for a puzzle later down the line. Oh. That. Ooh. I'm curious now. Surely there's something there. What is here? Nothing? Hey, Jimmy! Give me a cheese with nothing! Nothing? Damn. Thought I was onto something there. 
Ugh. Excuse me. Hmm. Let's see what's over here, I guess? Yeah. <clears throat> oh. Sorry, man. Uh, oh. I mean, I can just, uh... Mmm, I feel like I'm supposed to do something, but... Hmm. I feel like... Oh, I see. Well... Yeah, you're gay. Get out of here. I want to explain- Oh, I already read that. Damn it. We got, like, such an influx of new people, and I was like, Oh, let's- let's- let's read the new messages. Let's get on reading mode. Oh, wait. Working in a prison is not glamorous at all. You think the queen sends the lazy guards here? Maintaining this prison is not a game. She must send her best. Why not both? Ah, backtracking, okay. Wait, does this work? No. Er, yeah, it's safe. Safe for shits and giggles. It, it is a good practice to save as much as possible during an RPG. And I have not... <laughs> honestly, I have not been the best at that, so... At, at, at least with this game, I, I'm not the... The sharpest tool in the shed when, when thinking about stuff like that. Domain expansion. Gym security room. Let's go to the gym. Let's get let's get fucked up. Oh, I can't get fucked up. Uh, remember to put equipment back after using it. Others will use it after you. So we gotta figure out. Hmm. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I think I, f I think I faintly understand. Oh. I didn't hear it. All right. So we can't go in there yet until we can find a switch. I, I, I. Whoa. <laughs> if she sends both her laziest and best guards, who's going to be left to guard the throne room? The sane ones. <laughs> Alright, there's a switch there. Oh, there's a Kabu dig spot on the left. I see that. Alright. Why is this, why is this the security room? It doesn't seem special at all. There must be something hidden around here. Bye-bye. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to the gym first. Hmm, uh, eh, I feel like this is a test. I'm gonna go to the gym. Gonna go to the gym before I forget to go to the gym. La 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 la. Oh, wait, can I not? <laughs> oh, wait. I bug this. Fuck, there's an invisible wall! That's gay! That's gay! You're gay. That's some gay bullshit. Damn. Alright. I guess we are... I guess we are doing the, the digging. I want to go to the gym. I want to get... Uh, what What's the saying? Of getting, of getting absolutely yoked. I want to get absolutely yoked. Just gotta kind of fiddle my way around here. Hey, what's up, Vanguards? How you doing? How you doing? Uh, the wasps trapped us. Oh my god, the wasps trapped us here. Something is blocking the door and we can't get out. I'm the security chief here, or at least I was. After this, I am totally retiring. What a humiliating situation. I know we're in a difficult situation, but this here is the backup generator room. The wasps damaged the computer, but the only way to turn the backup power on is to spin that crank. Do you have any way to do it? Oh, you know it, baby. Oh, and because I was holding B to do that, that was also the button to skip the dialogue. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Hell yeah. Ah. Is the power on? Why is it not working? Eh, just kick it. This is valuable government. Just kick it. Well, it actually worked. See? Whatever. Let us see what we can do with this terminal. Toggle positions of the cafeteria tables. Oh! Uh, look at that! Where's the cafeteria? That would be on the left. Alright. Oh, I could also... Okay, I like how it allows you to do that by kicking. It's awesome. Alright, let's... Hit this, and then I guess we'll go straight back to that. But we need a key. 
we need a key for the cafeteria. And I just so happened to get... I, I just so happened to get rid of it. Is it not going to allow me to... Aw. Well, guess they're trapped there forever. And there's nothing I can do about it. Works every time. Fair. We gotta go to the library. Alright. Get out of my way. I don't have time to deal with you. Are, are we about to learn the bug Dewey Decimal System? I've always wanted to. This is quite the collection. It rivals the palaces. Having to read all of these is such a mean punishment. They're most likely not meant to be a punishment. Mystery book. The everlasting sampling, a relic that granted eternal life. Interesting, interesting. I... <laughs> What's up, dude? How you doing? Oh. It's just a bunch of books, so... Nonsense. There must be some sort of order we're missing. Uh, are we gonna have to read them? Ah, I see. Although it hasn't been found many... Okay. Hmm, I see. Okay, so we have to find all of the books... Put, and put them in in the exact order of, like, the actual sentence that reads out. Okay. Interesting. Rubber Totem of Undying. Oop. All right. I, f I, I get it. I get it. All right, so I gotta hit the switch to go back to... Go back to that area. Ugh. It's a big escape. It's basically a giant escape room. I like this shit, man. Again, I know I've said it like a million times already. Thank God. Oh. <gasps> I get it now. I don't get it now. So that's closed. That's what we need. That is what we need. Warning, the bridge shows signs of weakness. Careful when crossing. Domain expansion. Oh, I see. That's fine. No, that's fine. Yeah, it's chill. Peekaboo, what's up, Emerald Bros? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Oh, he learned the hard way we have easy mode turned on. No, it's not easy mode. It's just I'm like the fucking max level in this game. So I have like... Uh, I love it. I love it. All right. So I think what we have to do... Freeze the waterfall. Get... All the way up. Get to V. Boop. And boop. Nice. Nice. The Ant Queen and her daughters came searching for... There's a hole. Something could fit here. The Ant Compass? Why do I have the Ant Compass? Oh, right, right. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. I completely forgot what the Ant Compass was for. <laughs> I honestly don't have much to do right now. I need something good to play. Mmm. What games you got? Here. Give me, like, a... I'd say, like, a few... Give me a good, like, collection of games that you want to play. And I, I'll pick one for you. How about that? If you need someone to help, like, make the choice for you. There is something I'm supposed to do there. Wait. I don't think I went downstairs on that one door. Let's try that, actually. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. No, they hurt. You bastard. You should play Pikmin. Let's, let's, I don't think he has it. So let's, let's, uh, let the dude provide games for us. Let, let's have the options. And then as a collective, we will, we will try our best to decipher. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. We can hit the f like we can hit it here. Mm. 
you. Slouch, have you played anything recently since you've uh, been moving? Has anything like occupied your time, video game wise, or hell, a movie? What, what you got? What you got? What you got, slime? Oh, oh, this is cool. God damn it! I I'm really loving the puzzles in this game, dude. Okay, wait. Can I do this? I don't think I can do this first try. Maybe. Hmm. But then I would need a. Okay. 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 Okay, wow. Oh, wait. Wait, is this what I think it is? Oh, that's fucked. Oh, wait, that's so cool. Kind of hard to... Come on. Come on. First try. First try. Yeah, first try, baby. First try, baby. That was super fun. I've been playing an old boomer game called Gauntlet Dark Legacy. Oh, I've seen that at like retro game stores all the time. A training facility. Oh wait, a training facility? A gym, Kabu. They allow prisoners to stay fit and healthy. It's not like that'll help them break out. I think every prisoner here should be just completely, they should have no food, no water. They'll never escape because they're too hungry. We will feed them merely scraps. Kabu, that's really fucking dark. Yeah, Kabu, Jesus. <laughs> Look, I'm tired of being a goody two-shoes. I think it's about time I toughened up a bit. What do you think? Well, like, we, we you know, just have, like, more of an attitude. Not really, you know, be a dick to people. That, was, that wasn't really what we wanted. Yeah, Jesus, Kabu. I may have... Overstepped my boundaries, friends. I, I apologize. Instead of bouncing in circles, just stand in the center and wait for it to spin. That's not fun. You have no fun. You have no fun, angry artist. Live life on the wild side. With me for a second. Just for a second. I needed to go down to the cafeteria. Yeah, because that's where the key was needed. Kabu character arc. Yay. Hey, better than what the game actually gave us. That's a joke. I love Kabu as a character. I just wish they did more. That is all. All right. What the fuck? I moved this. I moved you. Whoa. <laughs> what? Huh? Yeah, that's fair. This is the most hardcore cafeteria we've ever seen. The food fights here have to be awesome. With those cannons, I don't think anyone would dare. Eh, eh, ah! Is it like a time thing? Maybe. Maybe. I'd like to see them outrun bullet. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Fair. <laughs> do they feed them rock? I don't know. Is there like a bug that canonically eats rocks? I know. Oh. I'm thinking of Gorons. <laughs> Gorons are not bugs. They're chill fucking guys, bruh. They're chill ass guys. What do you mean? Let's try that instead. They feed them boulder. Hmm. <laughs> Bugs eat stuff off of rocks? Yeah, well, that's not my- that's not my question. Hagrid's rock cakes? That... You know, I- I would like to hear word from that man's dentist in that case. Jesus. I wish bugs would eat the boulder. Damn. Hmm. Wait, can I do this? Nope. <laughs> the bubble shield does not resist a rock. Alright. So I did have it. What's the weird piranha plant looking thing? It is, her name is Bud and she is our little baby. She's basically a fourth party member. She can equip different bows like hair bows. And depending on the bow, she, her like bite attacks do different effects. Although I'm a basic bitch and I just, I primarily just use the ribbon that just gives her plus one attack. Cause I just, I don't know, I'm goofy like that. So I had it on the correct position. 
<laughs> the bug should get braver and bolder. <laughs> I don't get why Bug Fables doesn't have a, a partner in this game where it's just a giant rock. You know? But it has, like, some marker on it. And his name was Boulder. I feel like that would be a character you would see on fucking... I feel like that would be something you would see on, like, the obscure video game facts Twitter. Like, in Bug Fables, there is a secret fourth party member. It is just a boulder with eyes. Okay, what does this do? Oh. Why the fuck did I need to change the tables then? Fuck you. Book, book. Ah, the kingdom of Barget, Bulgaria. Many explorers gather here. I feel like there's more? Oh, we turned off the tables. Nice. Or we turned off the rocks. So wait, but that would have been there regardless, right? Am I stupid? Why did I need to change the position? I guess just to like ease to more easily get to the mushroom. Was it impossible without the tables? I wish our boulder was just a boulder with eyes. Well, our boulder canonically has like all of the all of uh, Kibbleton has uh has canonically vanished into ash. Uh, unfortunate. I'm sorry to tell you. I'm sorry to, to to break it to you this way, but unfortunately, it seems the uh, Kibbleton has been destroyed beyond repair, and I don't know when. At least here, here. I think what happened to them. Uh, the the totally legit 3DS I used to play Tomodachi Life uh, has been sued by Nintendo, and so it no longer exists. All that's- no. All that's left is a boulder, no. All that's left is the memory. The memory of my Tomodachi Life Island will live on. I assure you. Alright. Ah, the Kingdom of Bagaria, many explorers gather here? Hmm. The Ant Queen and her daughters came searching for... The Everlasting Sapling... Nice. Goku Bug Fables? You wish. You fucking wish. Now we gotta go back to the warden's office because that had the... Can I not? Yes, I could. Yes, I could, baby. I'm happy that they allow you to, to do shit like that. That's class. Oh yeah, that's class. This is a good puzzle, Chad. I like the puzzle. This is a good dungeon. I really like this dungeon. Holy shit. We're winning. We're winning. Sometimes it's easy to forget even a prison needs a normal office. Bleh. Sitting here processing paperwork, this is just as much of a prison as the other cells. Ah yes, there's rubber prison and then there's corporate prison. Ooh. Nice. Eto bleh. Dungeons and Dragonflies? Bro, that should be like a canonical like D&D expansion for Bug Fables. I'm telling you, that would be so good. <laughs> when will someone fix the third floor bridge? That thing looks like it could break down at any moment. Okay, so we were able to go here. What? Did we miss an area? Now I'm trying to think if we've missed anything. Nope, wrong. Hold B move. There we are. Rock Polish, have we... We gotta legally throw boulder toss in honor of the boulder. <laughs> I would rather have rubber prison than corporate. <laughs> e yuck. True. True. Chad, am I missing something? I don't... Because I have a key, but I don't know... No. Alright. Not that I know of we've missed anything, so... Yeah. Huh. If I'm, like, forgetting something, then apologies, but I don't know. Seeing someone going through this area and just skipping all the enemies is just really funny to me. We only needed, like, one of the enemies! I told you, bro! Like, we're max level. I'm- I'm chill. I just don't want to go- Here's my problem. I don't want to go all the way back to the Ant Kingdom and then, like, rebuy all of my items. I'm just- that's just not- that's just not me. I have earned- I have earned my place on the throne. This is the part of Paper Mario games like this where it's like really satisfying to be like, hey, I'm max level on hard mode. I'm doing a damn good job. Ah, see, that's where the key is, I see. 
I would rather have Rubber Man than Goku. Fair. Mm. The king's got his whole army up ahead. You'd best heal up. Oh, ma. Mm, I th eh, fine, fuck it. Spit on me. There you go, chat. You can clip that. Do what, do what you need to do with that, I guess. Never said it was a problem. It's just really funny. <gasps> ah, back travel. Or back travel. Uh, shortcut. But I love Goku for Fortnite. Everyone, the Wasp King's up ahead. Okay, well now he's further up ahead. Such poor defenses. This is to be expected from those ants. Stop right there. You're done. How many times must I knock you down before you learn? Third time's the charm, eh? I don't have time to deal with vermin. Ultimax! Ooh! What in the sideways beast stinger is that? Boy, that's cheating! What did we have for this guy? My king, I am here to carry out your will! Make it quick and painful. Do not let anyone cross this door. I think it was also like the general, like the, the overall, like, I clipped the spit. Cool. Let's follow his advice. Quick and painful. Your journey ends here, at the hands of General Ultimax! Alright, I'm gonna use this turn to prep shit. So, first things first, just in case he does AoE, we're gonna start with a Sharing Stash. Bam! Sharing Stash, and then we're gonna use Leaf's turn to Spy. Alright then, we've definitely never seen anything like this before. Even so, you're just another hurdle in our path. Kabu's horn should be able to pierce through. Oh, it's one defense leaf. Stop being such a baby. Come here. I will take on a tank. I will do absolutely everything in my power to do absolutely nothing. I'm done. That did no damage, dude! That did no fucking damage, dude! Fucking damage, dude! Oh, I love it. And now for the best battle theme name in the game, Battle Against Ultimax. Who has a tank? That's awesome. TF2 Soldier. Yeah, but then I was like, oh, all of my wasps have, like, shitty... <laughs> Your mother! Like, it's a shitty spy. Alright, so I have to remember next turn I gotta, I gotta move back. Alright, so let's give the damage buff to Leaf. And then we shall... We shall do an ice rain. Ice rainy. Nice. Good damage. Good damage. Give the turn to Kabu, which we will use to do nothing and taunt. You think if humans existed in this universe, the whole story wouldn't have happened since they would have probably squished the ants. But the ants have tanks. Exactly. Angry artist gets it. This guy gets it. It's getting ready to run us over, isn't it? I don't trust that for a fucking second. <laughs> I don't trust that for a fucking second. I'll use... Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. We we have turns, so I'm gonna use this turn to use a, use a donut. And then also, I guess might as well just... Yeah, just do nothing. Yeah, something tells me this guy's gonna try to rev us. Yeah. Alright. Cool, cool. I'm doing it, chat. I'm fucking doing it. Oh, it's in Kabu's position as well? Oh, I don't have to do shit then. Let's go. Uh, oh, I should've... You know what I should've done? I could've done a Frost Relay. But Ice Rain is probably better. It's probably, like, way more damage. What is that? 24 damage? Yeah, so we're already... The bullets would be equivalent of getting an acorn thrown at you, probably. Yeah, dude, they have war weapons. Dude, I'm telling you, dude, I am doing so good. Humans did exist at one point, but it's unknown why in the universe as to why they disappeared. Acorns hurt. 
Yeah, it depends on it depends on how hard the acorn is thrown. The proverbial acorn. I didn't give Kabu an extra turn to to dodge. What the fuck did I do? <gasps> oh, something happened. Something happened and I fucked it up. I don't remember. It's fine. It's fine. We'll live. We can live. <laughs> okay, somehow the block window was still there. I'll take it. All right. Give it to Leaf. Do another Frost Rain. Can I get both? Yes. That's awesome, that's awesome. Easy boss, easy boss on hard mode, easy boss on hard mode, let's go. No, my Ultimax tank, how could you? Easy boss, easy boss, we win these. Oh, <laughs> poor little baby, <laughs> poor little baby. Uh, honestly, yeah, we can taunt. He's so, he's so scared. He's cute little boy boy. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. To be honest, even without the power of nano machines, Kabu still barely takes any damage. 3 damage versus 28, 26 HP is nothing. Yeah. Now that we get to stack Kabu, here's the best part. Yeah, poison build, we have to like... Well, okay. We... Un at least before, before we were able to have the poison be regen instead of damage over time, we had to keep Kabu at a relatively low HP, so we were always like in a fine dance between life and death, unfortunately. But man, this build is, this build fucks. I love this build. This build is, I love this build so much. Uh, we can kill this guy in no turns, I forgot. Seven damage. We can kill that. I, I don't know. I want to be ballsy. I want to be ballsy, chat. I'm sorry. Aw, oh, just barely... Two damage, and then I think... Nah, four. Damn. Well, it doesn't matter who he attacks. Alright, cool. See you, man. Bye-bye. <laughs> we don't even get... Oh, yeah, right, because we're at, we're at max level. This is what have happened. This this is what would have happened if you left Ultimax till last in this original battle. By the way, he would have acted like this. Oh, I see. Okay. No, no, you won't pass. No one can pass. Knock it off. You already lost. No one will pass. Those are the king's orders. I I have to follow the king's orders. I I must follow. This is not normal. That wasp in the kingdom said everyone had gone nuts. Could this be? Could this one be controlled too? Just let us pass. You will have to cross my body. That works. That king employs such distasteful tactics. Let's leave this poor guy to the ant kingdom. Indeed, let's secure the area so reinforcements can come in. Then we'll have to give swift chase. I will send the signal. Kabu just screams really loud. Oh, the cowboy's here! Aren't you glad? I don't know who that is. Great work clearing the way, Team Snakemouth. Yeah, it's gonna be smooth sailing from here. We cannot celebrate yet. The Wasp King is brutally powerful. He's gonna pay for bruising you. Mama! Indeed. But for now, we, have for we are fortunate to have gotten this far. Are we sure that it is alright with everyone having come? Queen Bianca has gracefully offered to protect the Ant Kingdom while we fulfill this mission. Well, I thought she was a super pacifist. <laughs> Can't reason with a mad bug. My knights and trusted explorers, make your final preparation. Make your final preparations. We venture into Chine's lair, No Bug's land. None have returned from it. We have no legends, no way to know what's inside. But if we do not face this challenge, we don't deserve tomorrow's freedom. Let us pray to Venus and charge. What a magnificent rally. I'm pumped up. Hmm. She's come far, hasn't she? Even you were moved, eh, Leaf? Time to kick some butt. 
It is time. Bulgaria will be saved today, but I too will reclaim my people. Let's go. Idols first. They eat all of you. I wonder if Kabu can eat Boulder. I think so. I wouldn't be surprising. Can I please? The final tunnel. Oh my fucking god. No! I guess we can go back to go back home. So it doesn't matter. Let's talk to everyone. Looks like everyone is here. Let's stop the Wasp King. Oh, mama. Huh, I've been polishing my darts. That jerk messed with the wrong family. We cannot thank you enough for all you've done, Team Snake Mouth. Even before the Wasp King struck, I'm glad I gave you a permit. S Sir Maki! I told you I was worth like four bees. We missed that whole thing. You'll have to share the tale over some food when we're done. Team Snake Mouth, there is nothing left to say as my orders are clear. But thank you for escorting me through the Forsaken Lands. Thank you, our Queen, for making the journey. It is thanks to you we got the submarine. It was my duty, my duty, my duty and honor. I hope you will escort me once more. Count on it. We're on even standing, Team Snake Mouth. You're too decent to tag along with Mathiva. That's for me to decide. Look, whatever, just beat a bunch of baddies up. Huh, <laughs> that's the plan. Break a leg. B break a leg? It, uh, it, it means good luck. <laughs> Have you chosen to laugh just because? I'm just delighted. We're going to be famous. The books will speak of the great Mathiva's valiant role in saving Bagaria. Yeah, in a little corner next to our portrait. We'll see about that, Runt. We'll see indeed, but today we are comrades. Um, Eri, are we really strong enough? Shut up, Jen. Remember when we set that bomb trap? Heh, <laughs> yeah, that was pretty cool. Just, to, just set a trap behind the baddies, too. We'll be counting on you. Oh gosh, no pressure, right? Well, just a bit of pressure. Let's do this, sis. Thank you for escorting us and defeating Scarlet. We'll pull our weight this time and repay our debt. It was nothing. You helped us protect Dini. You helped us protect Neo, after all. Hey. Hey. I'm a bit nervous. We are a bit nervous too. I can't. My fucking speech impediment's going crazy today. But Levi super pumped up, so I won't let any fear show. That's what true courage is, facing our fears. Let's bravely face that tyrant and save the kingdom. I think I need to, you know. Ah, just, you know, just calm down a bit. Deep breaths, everybody. Deep breaths. <laughs> that was not a deep breath. <laughs> I'm a, I lie, me when I spread misinformation. Also, a little fun fact, the Wasp King's axe was originally Ultimax's, but uh, I'm sure you can figure out how the Wasp King got his hands on it. Eh? Oh, it was originally Ultimaxis, but the Wasp King got his hands on it. Oh, by mind controlling him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Breathe! Breathe! I'm just hyper, bro. I don't know. Lead the way when your preparations are complete. This is the entrance to the Giant's Lair, Team Snake Mouth. Be careful. All right. We'll go home. We'll make one donut because we... No, we ate two. We ate two donuts. Two donuts were eaten that day. We still need to eat them. Oh, look at that. A full... F oh, man. Look how far we've come, Chad. Oh, my God. Ultimax deserves spaghetti. Yeah, I agree. No quests on the board? Damn, we've done them all. Okay, okay. Let's uh, go to the house. chat i want to do a little might night before we go i'm going to show might night off to the people that haven't seen might night the front of the house just falls off when you enter yeah it's like paper mario brah we'll do some might night to kind of de-stress for a brief second we had a bit of we did a dungeon we did good we did great let's uh pull let's you know let out some steam with a little bit of Might Night, you know? So, for those that didn't watch the stream on Wednesday, this is a side mode that basically is a dungeon crawler. 
Oh my god. I died. <laughs> yeah, okay. So the shield spamming strat did not work like last time. So it is it is a dungeon crawler. And basically we're trying to get to like the, the entrance. We're trying to get to like, we're trying to get through three floors and get the highest score by killing as many things as possible. <laughs> oh, this sucks. Okay, just take our time. Come on, I know you're out there. Oh, you bastard. Right. I think the exit was somewhere down here. We'll probably have to go through here. Get a little bit of help. Wait, could have sworn. Wait, who's attacking me? Oh. Okay, we'll have to start looking. What the hell was that? What do you mean? This is Might Knight. This is a critically acclaimed arcade game, Might Knight. Do you not know what Might Knight is? Might Knight could do with being braver and bolder. True. the key. Nice. And then I saw some bad guys. There we go. Mm -hmm. uh, we can get the potion here. We have the key, so it's going to be on the opposite end of the map, so. I think I saw a wizard here. Yeah. Oh, there's two wizards! The old double wizard trick. I'm not one to fall for such a foolish and depth fuck. Okay, well I fell for that. This is not meant to be played with a controller. I'm just gonna say. It definitely, it, it feels a bit better with a, uh, it feels better with a, with the D-pad. But, you know, that would be even better if I wasn't using the Switch Pro Controller D-pad. I do love the uh, pixel. Uh, is it called dithering? I don't know what the the correct. Wait, what the fuck? Did you take three hits? When the hell do you take three hits to be taken down? Blasphemy. Ow. There we go. There we go. I think that's a high score. Jeff Fun, you got 9,366 tokens. Nice. All right, we'll do one more. One more. One more Might Night. One more. And then we have to make a donut. We have to make two donuts. Oh my god, the key's right in front of us. Look at us. We're going places, chat. I'm telling you. Do, 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 My god. Oh god, nope. Oh god, nope. Please turn. Oh god. There we go. We have the key as well, so we can just immediately go to the next floor. Might night in the back rooms? Eh, kind of. I can see that. Oh god, no oh god, oh get it, yo, stop. Stop panicking. There we go. Let's get this guy. Oh my god, that's bloaty. You're a bit of bloaty. That's it. We don't have the key. That's gay. Let's walk. Mm-hmm. 
This soundtrack is fucking boppin'. It's good. I like it. Alright. Which way are you going? You're fast! Get away! Uh-uh. No. You get back here. Oh. Come on. We're definitely way far away from the key. Try to end my- yeah, always- I, I figured, yeah, there's bonus points for having, like, max HP, so I'm not gonna, you know, I'm gonna try my best to make sure I have max HP by the end. Oh wait, there's a wizard here. Hmm, wizard and an ant. Aw, oh, shit. Fortunately, potion. Alright, let's get to the end. Bam. I think we did really good that time. Yeah, look at that, 11,000, or, yeah, 10,000. Nice. It's 11,000. That's 81 tokens. Hell yeah. High scores. Might Knight, yeah! Let's go! I got the high score. Scribbling on paper is quite enjoyable. Awesome. As for my question, it is, it is, it is a good, it's one of the simple pleasures in life, you know? Alright, we gotta go back to Defiant Root. I have healed. Everything is of, in order. Let us go to the... Ow! I love, I love Might Knight. It's fun. It's a very simple minigame. I, I don't know what it was, but... Recently, I've been looking back on my time in uh, Dragon Quest XI, my favorite- it's one of my, like, favorite RPGs of all time. Especially on the Switch, it's like one of my favorite Nintendo Switch games ever. And it's not even like- it's like 11S was Switch? So technically it's a Switch game? It's like very big technical, it's just one of my favorite RPGs ever made. I love that game. And I remember the grinding experience, and I guess like, you know, the Might Knight. If you have never played Dragon Quest XI, there is a, you know, there is a part of the game where you basically are in a casino and you do, like, slot, machi slot machine stuff. I remember going in that slot machine and just grinding for hours just so that I could get a, a, this, like, platinum longsword. And I'm happy I did because that platinum longsword, like... I had that, that was like the strongest thing I could get for like the rest of like the main game. And it was awesome. It was great. Big donuts. Yeah, bro. That's what I'm doing, bro. Yeah. We are, we are, our donuts are back into full capacity. Oh wait, let's see if this guy has any extra berries. No longer have anything. Fuck you! Get more! I want another attack berry so bad, chat. I want an attack berry so bad. I want an attack berry so bad, just for the simple sense of I want to make Leaf even stronger. Even though that boss has shown, I do not. I absolutely 100% do not need to be getting any stronger anytime soon. I just, I just don't. Rip Barry. Yee. Team Snake Mouth. May we be of service, Queen Vanessa. While you ventured into the Termite Kingdom, I did some studying of my own. I think the Wasp King is hiding something. The source of his strength. It probably lies in his crown. Huh? How's a crown gonna pump you up? Before I explain, I want you to have this. The Wasp Queen has entrusted you with the flame brooch. What is this amulet? It feels so... warm. This is the Wasp Kingdom's royal heirloom. My mother gave it to me and told me to protect it no matter what. Queen, is it really alright for us to have this? 
Of course. See, this emblem's been protecting me all this time. I don't get how this is gonna help. This amulet's magical. I don't know how, but it always protected me against, against the Wasp King's flames. I'm not a fighter, but you will most likely need this more than I do now. We will safeguard it. It is an honor to be entrusted with the royal treasure. Be safe, and beat the heck out of that usurper. We don't even know who this fucker is. I wanna- I can't wait to know the- the everlasting sapling chapter 7. We're at the end! It's fucking happening. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at that! What is this feeling? It's as if I was carrying many boulders. Yeah, it's some sort of violent aura. I'm fine, aren't you guys overthinking it? But, but it is kind of creepy in here. Ugh. So fucking quiet. There was a giant. I saw, I know there was like a giant fucking creep. Wait! Oh, wait! Goddess Venus, what's the matter? Listen, this is very important. I've been keeping track of your travels through my buds, but this is my limit. I can't help you past here. You'll be on your own. We can feel some strong bloodlust coming from the area ahead. Yes, this is where the Deadlands start. Disgusting, heinous creatures roam that area where giants lived. They are stronger than anything you will find in Bulgaria. I can't fathom why they're- why they've ever- oh my god. Ugh. I can't fathom why they've never tried crossing over. The roaches braved such horrors just to hide the everlasting sapling? Makes sense, right? It's the ultimate challenge. This isn't a game, I'm serious. We're serious too. This ain't just about treasure anymore. The wasp king- oh my god. Ugh. Mm. Okay, I can't fucking drink soda. If I want a VO shit, so I'm not- I'm not drinking the Mountain Dew anymore, I'm getting water. I'm telling you, man. It's like the sugar- it's the sugar rush I get, and it's like the- 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 just how sticky your mouth feels. Time for freaky crap, oh no. And now my favorite area in the game, get ready, ooh. Alright. The Wasp King seems determined to, oh my god, determined to go on ahead, beyond reason. Even though it's dangerous, we cannot risk him succeeding in his quest. Yeah, we can't let him roam around, for everyone's sake. Oh, please be careful. I've grown so fond of you all. If you need any healing, just ask me. I really won't be able to help later. Thanks. Alright, team, we're going after that jerk. Hmm. Alright, so we will just always go back here, if needed. Ooh, god, water is better. I know. I just wanted to, like, drink something, like, remotely, you know, outside of water, you know? Because I just, you know... I wanted to celebrate the occasion that it is the... What the fuck? What the fuck was that? What, 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 what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck was that? <laughs> Rock polish? What was that? Did I just get- oh, Was I about to get fucking wall mastered? <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. What the fuck? What do you mean, smile? What the fuck? Fuck. Okay, we saved. Let's do it. I wanna. Yeah, come on. Oh! 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 We didn't. These guys, uh, overdo the. Oh no. Dead lander. What is that? Why? Oh, what the fuck is the why? I don't know what's scarier, this or the thing that dropped it. Maybe we should flee. That claw's super scary, but the spores are trouble too. We gotta be careful. Well, I have to kill it. It's in my nature. Oh my fucking god. 
I think I'm a couple seconds behind. Uh, the, I'm at the lowest latency I can for my uh, for my resolution, so unfortunately, there's not much else I can do on the matter. Oh, he's asleep. He's sleepy. Oh no. Um. Run, run, Raggy! It's the spores. Is it immune to ice? I want to try something. It is not immune to ice, or it potentially is. Five damage! Ho ho! Ho ho! Ho ho! Ho boy! Ho boy! Ho boy! I love him! Alright, we know what to do now. It's okay. We potentially shock it because we're not me. Jesus. Two defense as well. Jeez. This game really just out of nowhere took a what fuck left turn, huh? <laughs> like, what the what the hell? Bit the big guy that drops this thing is Deadlander Omega, by the way, and they're also that thing you saw roaming before. Oh. <laughs> Zoink Scoop, that thing has a claw. <laughs> Scoop, I think I pissed myself. <gasps> we numbed it! Let's fucking go! Yeah! Yeah! Dude, oh, I'm so proud. I'm so proud. I'm so proud. Kabu. Bro, he did it. Our baby did it. Just, yeah, just get turns. It's, oh my god, that's, that's class though. Okay, we can kill this thing. That's supposed to pierce. I thought that was supposed to pierce. Clearly, I don't know what I'm doing. Hmm. Ain't that the predicament? God damn, dude. <sighs> All right. Yeah, these guys are bosses in and of itself. Awesome! I want to look at this fucking thing again. All right, well, let's go back. Let's go back. Heal. Let's heal. Let's heal. Let's heal. Ugh. Ugh. Creepy. Jesus! Like, out of nowhere, this game just immediately became like a pseudo horror game. Like, no fucking warning either. Yeah, it's like, oh, Deadlanders. Oh, what's it gonna be? Is it gonna be like? A so big, big, a big armored bug? No. No. God. Ugh. What do you mean? Ah! Oh, I didn't. I didn't know. <laughs> oh, stop! <laughs> <laughs> On the platform, jump on the platform! We can't jump! <laughs> Can I? Nope. Nope, you can't bubble shield. Oh, that's evil. That's evil, dude. That's evil. That is so fucking evil, dude. Nope, leave me alone. Be alone. God, it's a fucking survival horror now. That's evil. No, it's fine. We're fine. We're fine, actually. Wait, there's something over. No, there's not. <sighs> what the fuck? Oh, yay, knife. It's just a knife. Eep, what the heck is that? It's monitoring this area. Oh, my God. It's monitoring the area. 
looking for things to devour. I would prefer if we never learned what will happen if it sees us. Oh, don't worry. We found out. What is that thing? <laughs> the theme when Deadlander Omega spots you is straight up called, huh? Even the damn OST doesn't know what's going on with these guys. God, the music doesn't... Oh, God. I wasn't ready for this to... Genuinely was not ready for this to just become a survival horror. Yeah, What is this slimy stuff it's spitting? Gross. Deadlander Beta. No matter how much I hit it, it's not going down. Guess it's up to me. What do you mean? What? <laughs> that, like, defies my entire build. Kidding. Oh, it's not kidding. Okay, well, I'm running. I'm good. What the hell is that thing? This is not very skibbity. Guys, this isn't skibbity. What the heck is that? Is that even a bug? Deadlanders creep me out. Deadlander Alpha. It's got all sort of poisons and it can dig. Leaf be ready to bring it out. Alright, well see, this is a guy I can fight. So let's fight this guy. Damn it. Okay. Digs up. Alright. Oh, wait. Mm. Excuse me. And then let's change back. Change back to Pretty Ribbon. Up, and there we go. There we go. Much better. <laughs> Get some good damage on there, bud. Okay, should... Yeah, should be just enough. Let's go! Oh, God, so fucking creepy, dude. Mystery berry. Restores? 8 HP? Oh, the fuck even is it? No, if I drop that, it's gonna start looking. dig why can't I? okay oh fuck this is scary oh it's straight up a doors entity yeah oh why does it fucking look like that <laughs> oh i was not ready for this <laughs> Oh, we have to do an ice puzzle! Great, 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 great. That's awesome, that's awesome. That's what I wanted. Gab no like horror? I'm fine. I like horror. Just wasn't fucking expecting it. You know? That's all. It was just that I wasn't expecting it. Is he gonna pick it up? He's like, yeah, the ice cube. I've seen the ice cube before. 
It's just, it caught me so off guard. Because I was not expecting it to be horror. That's the only thing, is that... If I was going into this expecting this to be fucking SCP, then I would have had that knowledge. But I didn't. That's the thing. It's, like, the best of horror is when it's least expected, you know? And it's just, it's not even like a jump scare, it's just genuinely creepy. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? Nope! That's gay. That's gay. It's gay as fuck. But I dig! I dig! What do you mean? I dig. I dug. I dug, you bastard. Okay, I need to immediately get rid of Bug Me Not. Where's Quick Escape? Quick Flee. That's gonna be way better. It's stuck in that, you bastard! Where do I go? Where do I go? <laughs> the Deadlanders are great at giving you the intense what the actual hell reaction. G genuinely, I, I firmly believe that. Even I can't dig under them. Oh, that sucks. Yo, dog, it's 10 p.m. Go to sleep. <laughs> sure, pal. I am I stuck? I guess I have to reset if I want the if I want to have that area back. Oh, that works too. All right. So can he see me while I'm dig? Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> Can you see me? No. Okay, for some reason it just barely registered. The reaction I get when I see them is guttural vomiting. That's fair. Fuck. Okay. Oh, <gasps> maybe? Like get up there and then hover up? I think it's like maybe? Yeah, just barely. <laughs> you bastard! Why the fuck did you- <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> what do you mean, stop? No! <laughs> Notice the wasp soldier spears all around? Yeah, I can imagine they didn't last very long. Ugh. Unfortunately, they're stuck there. Let's. Alright. <laughs> okay, we'll have to. Hand? <laughs> go, 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 go. God, fucking terrifying chat. My god. Again, it's just... This game was so bright and bubbly and cheerful. And then this shit happens. <laughs> and then it's like, ah, okay. I see I am playing a different game now. <laughs> Alright, do I... I don't think I can get away from this without hiding. Right? Like, yeah, get this here. And then have that happen. <sighs> that works. Uh, technically, he didn't see me. Chat, technically, <gasps> he didn't see me! <laughs> Watch as he immediately moves to the next area. Yeah. No, that's fair. That's fair. You know what? I didn't think about it like that. Get me the fuck out of here. Ugh. God. Freaky deaky, dude. Get me out of here, please. This place is absolutely dreadful. I've s I've sung in worn down pubs fancier than this. Those dead landers aren't anything to mess with either. I pray we won't run into too many of them climbing this behemoth. 
It seems to be a machine. The giants handled power at such a large scale. And it's a bit chilly near it. It reminds us of the Lost Sands Castle. Well, whatever, we we can be as tall and as cold. It can be as tall and as cold as it wants. We're gonna climb it. Such a simple mind. Let's go in then. Wait! What is it? Everyone, we've been surrounded. What the heck? When? We should fall back. There's no way out. They've completely pincered us. You know, there's a hail spot in the bottom right corner of that last area. Well, we're just gonna have to suck it up. <laughs> what if it's just one giant entity with multiple pairs of eyes? I would piss myself. I would piss myself if that was what it was. Everyone, there is no choice. We fight as one. Well spoken, my knight. I shall assist thee as well. Ugh. Hey, we got friends. Oh, I have to fight that gay bullshit. Alright. This is gonna be a bit of a bitch. Oh, wait, this actually might be really tough. Uh, let us see. Let's see what we can do here. We have berries. I want to see if any of these guys are weak to ice. So, let's find out. Got some good damage. V, I want you to... Honestly, I kind of want you to give it to Leaf. So I want to I want to get that flying bastard out of there as fast as possible. There. Okay, that guy's gone. Everything else is manageable for the most part. Yeah, we're good. We're good now. <sighs> Fuck, I was nervous. Luckily, Maki does six damage to the enemy in front each turn. Ooh. Six base damage, I'm assuming. Yeah, I just... There was just a lot of enemies there. I really did not want to deal with that. We're good now. We're good now. Mm. I should have. Yeah. Part of me should have just used a donut. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, we'll get rid of this guy. <laughs> what if it was a balloon animal? Even worse. Ugh. Terrifying. True horror. Damn it. Jesus. Alright, Maki's gonna... T oh, but Maki won't see... Yeah. Okay, so I have to... Get that guy out. All right, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Mm. Mm. Oh, wait. It does six and it pierces? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, that's actually really cool. I didn't know that that six damage was, like, genuinely consistent. I thought it was, like, six base damage. That's, that's really good, actually. Damn. I mean, granted, they probably were like, this is not where we want you to stop, so. Ayo. The power of, of ice rain saves us once again. Good thing the others stayed back. That was close. N not at all. Phew. Everyone, you did splendidly. The, clo the coast is clear. Well, duh, you were with us. Let's pressure forward. We must- we- we need to find a way to get the others to come over. Holy shit, I'm having struggle- I'm struggling with the dialogue tonight, sorry. I hate how its teeth cover its eye- We were fortunate to have help. The Deadlanders must be slowing the Wasp King down as well. Let's catch up. Please tell me there's a- There's no way you guys were serious about there being a fucking- Oh, uh, that's a big fucking crystal. You guys were- there's no way you guys were serious about there being a healing area. There's no way you guys were serious. I- I- She said that there was no way back. 
I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I don't believe you, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Some would say I trust chat a bit too much. What the hell? What the hell is that? I mean, we have to fight it. There is a heal crystal. It was red. I wasn't ready for it. Okay, we can... Oh, we healed after the boss fight. I'm such an idiot. No, flee, flee, flee. Get the fuck out of there. Nah, nah. No, we healed after the boss fight. Fortunately, the game allowed us to heal after the boss fight, so I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Balloon Sea Slug. <sighs> I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. It's cool, though. I didn't realize that, but yeah. Alright. Let's talk. Yeah, they're still here. We must press on. We cannot let the Wasp King get to the sapling before us. Climbing that thing will be a monumental task, however. <sighs> God, I fucking hate those. Ugh, God. It's cold. Jump and stretch, V. You must keep your body warm. You seem fine, Kabu. The chub must be helping. It's muscle. <laughs> Jesus, Leaf. Oh, it's these guys. You already fought these guys, right? Yeah. E. All right. That's the only red crystal in the game, and it does heal you, but it also instantly alerts the big eye beast. Oh, you fucker. You almost brought that... Mm, mm, you almost brought a... I can't believe you would allow that to happen. Wait, freeze it. Come on. Oh, there's a way. Oh, come on. Up. And then... Oh, what? What? Oh, you are... You're evil! You're evil! Maybe... No. You want a bugs in my freezer. I just wanted ice cream. Come on. Oh, this is going to be picky. I don't think this is what I'm supposed to do. But it feels like it. Maybe I'm supposed to do it. Oh. Mm, I have an idea. All right. So let's. I think I have to start the puzzle over. How far can I bring this? Can't bring it far. I can't bring it any further than... Well, in that case, don't I just... No, it's still not... Oh. There we go. That's how I do it. Okay. Okay. I got it. At least I think I do. How far can I throw this? Not very far. And then we bring this all the way to the lower part. There we go. Damn it. 
And then... Hmm. Yeah. There we are. All right, next layer. Guy really liked his fucking to mount. All right. The fuck is going on with this guy's freezer? I understand that this is like potentially like hundreds of years or so after all this shit, but like, damn, bro. This is not a well-kept fridge. Oh. Oh, wait. Okay, wait, wait. I want to try something. So it does stop according to the ice. Okay. So in that case, we want to... Bring this down here. Bam. Now what did that do? Did that, like, do anything? I don't think there's a reason to do that. I'm confused. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Again, fucking amazing puzzle platforming. I love it. Is this not too far? Mm, nope, it's exactly what we needed. Okay, so I was doing it correctly. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> but this is my freezer. Stop insulting my freezer. This is the same vibe to me as insulting someone for their ugly house in Fallout. Damn. I just like my format. I just like my tomat. It's just weird. I don't know. I think it's funny. Oh, damn, I thought I was doing good. <laughs> then, I, then I saw this. And now I'm a denier. <laughs> All right, I think what it wants me to do, of course, is to freeze this. All right. that fucking do? Hmm. Alright, alright. Is that really what I want to do? Yes, it is. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. Alright. Okay, so then I would freeze you. Nope, I I guess I don't. You're the one inside my freezer? Yeah, I mean, like... You said you had ice cream, I want some. Do you ever think that, you know, other people would want the ice cream, you know? You ever think about that, huh? I have an idea. We go up here. Oh. Get up there. God damn. Ride the lift. What's here? Nothing. Right, we will ride the lift. Holy shit, we did it. Ah, da da! Nope. This place. Is this. The Roach Village? This is. a village? Halt, or be impaled! Oh, roaches! Let's go. 
roaches. No way! So something didn't vanish after all. Huh. You did halt. You may be just, or simply cowards. Please, allow us to explain the situation. We are short on time. Blech. There's nothing to explain. Everyone's after the sapling today. The sapling? It is real, then. Silence. You've spoken too much. S sorry, Elder. You come with that crook? No, please, in the name of my people, allow me to explain. The expedition has been dumped. I see. To think that after uneventful generations guarding that sapling, so many would come for it in just one day. That wasp king you're talking about snuck past us while we dealt with his troops. He used them like pawns, not caring about their lives at all. Disgusting. How can he treat his loyal followers like that? <laughs> you do have a heart. Please, allow us to go after him. And what will you do when you get the, when you get the sapling from him? Just what are you planning to do with our sacred treasure? I... I had a dream. To use its power to fulfill my wish- Boom, but to fulfill my wishes. But the lust for that power has only brought turmoil to Begaria. I will destroy it. But what about your mother? She entrusted her dream to me, and I fulfilled it. The land teemed with explorers searching for the ultimate treasure. She would be proud for me. She deserves to rest. How dare you spin your words as noble? The sapling is sacred. Elder, if they destroy it, what will be of us, our life's purpose? That crook may be mad, but he wouldn't desecrate our treasure like you. <laughs> you heard the Elder. She never changes her mind. You won't pass. We'll just have to knock. No, V, this is not the way to solve this. They are blinded by their devotion. Understandable. Elizant, our queen, we will support you. We must plead our case once more. I guess the others and I will make ourselves cozy for now. Okay, I admit it, I might have an infestation. Damn. Oh, there's an inn. Okay, we're going there new. Ah. Uh, but there's no fast travel! Just carry you back to the ancient entrance. Yes! Will it carry me back up here? Please tell me it does. It does not. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. I don't have to be, I don't have to deal with Omega. <laughs> I don't have to deal with Omega. Oh, thank fucking God, dude. Oh! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. How do we get back from... We would have to go all the way- Oh, there's the rubber prison entrance. Okay, how many- how many donuts do I have left? Oh, I have all five donuts. Oh, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. I have all five donuts. Gosh. Okay. What's up, man? You can sit around. We know how dreadful the land is, but we won't let you pass through. Ugh, that king's strength. The constructs must be going wild. Hey, we, we somehow made it through, but it's too much. We believe in you. You can do it. Ugh, what strength that king held. What a monster. I assume there are roaches living in other lands. Wherever they are, what purpose did they find without the sapling? Uh, they worked on me. They worked on me. I was what they, I was what they were doing. You, blue guy, I can feel you swimming with roach magic. Where did you get that? It's super dangerous, but they're all pretty calm. When you live surrounded by danger, it seems you get used to it. No way, I would never get used to the Deadlanders. And yet they've had no choice. You're lucky I didn't have to let out my prized scorpion after you. Scorpions are dangerous? Please, compared to the Deadlanders, they're the tamest of the tame. Phew, I'm glad I met Levi. He saved me so many times. We've got to get through this. 
I believe myself an able fighter, but this land is brutal. I will entrust the Ant Kingdom's future to you, Team Snake Mouth. This place is a bit of a trap, but I've been to worse places. Maybe I should tour here sometime to try to liven things up. Even though it's safe here, we cannot relax. Can I protect Mathiva from what's ahead? <coughs> I don't know. <laughs> roaches are epic. I like the design of the roaches. I think they're chill. I think they're chill. Oh, that fire magic. It's something else. Ma. What a dumb delay. I'm ready to fight alongside Maki. Okay, there's that. So that's progress. I'm gonna... I'm good. Yeah, I'm full health, so I don't need to rest. That's the end of the... <laughs> that's the end of the sentence. Uh, I, I don't have to rest yet. Uh, let's save. Little roach helmets. They're cool. I like the design of the roaches. They're very simplistic, but I'm a sucker for some good browns. I'm a sucker for good browns if that wasn't, uh, obvious with, like, my color palette. My word is final. We won't let you through. Please, you must listen. Team Snakemouth, you're here. Perhaps you have some words of persuasion. Yeah, it's called the beep. Stop it! Ow! A few, if you'll allow us. Please. This is something only V and Kabu knew, but we are not of this time. We served under the first Queen Elizant. What? Is it true, Kabu? Y yes. It was not our secret to tell. The roaches used to roam Bulgaria, even if they secluded themselves a bit. When we were found, we discovered they had all disappeared, and no one knew why. But during our travels, we found a laboratory. Roaches had experimented on others, creating vile monsters. What? All in the hope of replicating a fraction of the sapling's power. What good has the sapling done anybody all these moons? All it has done is plunge explorers into danger, and now that mad king's gone crazy for power. Even our late queen was tempted by the promise of eternal life. The saplings only hurt others by existing, even you. You live trapped in this forsaken place, Guarding an ancient temptation. Leaf, thank you for your words. Won't you reconsider, Elder? When I was born, my mother said the sapling is the key to everything. Good, evil, it all comes from this sapling. It is sacred. So sacred that we endure to protect it. And so we have for so long. But you're right, aren't you? What good has it done to us? Every time a child strays too far, never to be seen again, it's the sapling's fault. Sacred my husk. Th then you'll reconsider. But wait! Elder, are you sure? I'm sorry, I, I had a voice crack for a second. What will become of us? Speech 100. Ye. We will find a new purpose. One that doesn't doom us to live on the edge of violence. One that lets us enjoy the plains of legends again. Elder, thank you. You are welcome in our kingdom to explore that possibility. I... I can't believe it. We'll let you pass to the sapling plains. Go destroy that sapling. Our new future depends on it. We could have done it sooner. Let's run. V really doesn't get politics, does she? That's why she's our V. Let's finish this. Yeah. Let's fucking go! That was nice. A good write-off to the... to the story. A good write-off to the roaches, I feel. It felt like it didn't overstay its welcome. It's a little short, but you know what? It didn't overstay its welcome, which is appreciated. What the fuck is that thing? What the fuck is that? Help! Ooh. Ooh, this fucking check kinda slaps, though. Are you alright? That monster. He put the place on fire and rushed through the flames. <laughs> through the fire and the flames, that's... Even our bubble shield couldn't... couldn't... couldn't pull that off. Ugh, the sapling. Save your strength. Everything's fine now. 
Ugh, you just had to say that, didn't you? Everyone protect this roach. I was waiting for you to say it. Alright. So it's the same thing, it's just they have fire damage now. Alright. Uh, I don't think they'll have a lot of AoE, so I'm just gonna give my turns to Leaf. Leaf will kill that guy in like two turns alongside, so we won't- yeah, we'll, f we'll fight the Living Cloak first. Yeah, that- Oh fuck, I wasn't ready for that. Oh, I'm on fire! Fire, fire, fire! <laughs> Help! Alright. Hmm, I can do an ice rain. And there's an inn, like, right by us, so... That wouldn't be the worst. Eh, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking Ice Rain. There we go. Triple kill. Ah, my, my fucking ankles. Ah! <laughs> I cracked my ankle. I don't know if that picked up on the camera. Ah, or it picked up on the microphone. The real camera that, I, that you're looking at right now. This is my real form. Incredible. You took out the construct so fast. They were like those in the sandcastle. They're usually harmless, but that monster's appearance riled them up. As if that wall of flames wasn't enough trouble. We'll have to find a way to cross or shut them off. Even more of them? What did we even do to them? Team Snakemouth, my queen, leave these to Kina and I. Trying to hog all the glory, eh? Stop being annoying. We need you to turn off that fire. Team Mathiva, Team Snakemouth, I will remain to assist Maki in defending the village. Uh, a queen will do that for us? Uh, are you sure? We could stay as well. Time is of the essence. I need your teams to quell those flames. Make haste. Bagaria is counting on you. We'll be back before you know it. Yeah, let's go. Try not to slow us down. Oh. What do the fire boulders taste like? Spicy, probably? Ooh. It's fair. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go back. I'll be right back. <laughs> That's evil. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I just gotta make sure. I'm hoping you don't snore. <laughs> Welcome to the Pokemon Center. I don't think we've... I think we've only lost money this entire time. All right. Let's save up our healing items as much as we can because I don't want to backtrack all the way back. It's just not my plan. Random pretty roach lady jump scare? Hey. We take those. We take those. Alright, can I... Yeah, none of these guys are gonna get affected by my... Ooh, how the fuck do I get there? Can I... <laughs> Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. I can't believe that worked. That doesn't feel like that's how it's supposed to work. Welcome to the hospital. Hope you come back soon. Alright, we're just gonna run away. I'm not gonna lie. The fights are cool, but at the same time... Uh, I've solved their puzzles before. I'm here to, to see the end credits and see how this goes. Nothing happened! There must be something else we missed. Let's look around, then. Put it in there. Okay, so there's another- there's more. More than reach the eye. Shit. Mmm. Fine. Fine. Yeah, fine. Whatever. <laughs> Oh, 
There we go. Oh, much better. Much better. Okay, so we just have to do a bit more. Okay, so I don't have to do Ice Rain all the time. That's good. <laughs> we are depending on you. Immediately dips. Yeah, it really be like that sometimes, man. Ooh, nice. Ooh, 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 baby. We take those. Can I... Nah, I'll just focus on that one. Eat damage! Honestly, I think we can just taunt. Okay, immediately I'm just gonna real quick just do nothing to heal. And then have leaf attack. There we go. Doesn't Deep Taunt lower enemy defense? It only lowers armor. It, it lowers one armor. That's the problem. Is that if they don't have armor, it doesn't do shit. Could have sworn I knocked it. Back once again. What's up, the dude? Oh, fuck off. I'm not fighting that. That's gay as fuck. That's gay as fuck. I don't want to deal with it. Nah. Look, I put the 40 hours in. I think I, I'm in the place where I can just say nah. Ah, I see, I see, I see. So somehow we have to get all the way up there. Interesting! Get it off, get it off, get it off, get it off! How do I get up there, though? Oh, I see. I tried to freeze it. All right, let's try that again. Can I not freeze? You can't freeze that thing. <laughs> I don't know why, but you can't. Can you not freeze? I thought you could freeze things. Nope, you can't. You can't. Get away. <gasps> oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I see. I see it. I was uh, trying to be one step ahead and it, it isn't paying off. Ah, damn it. There's something up there I can do. Oh. Ah! <laughs> I got scaled. Oh. See, that probably would do a lot more than what I was trying to do. Yeah. Hi, I'm fucking stupid, and you're watching the Disney Channel. Okay, I thought I had to do like an intricate like set of like flying platforms to get like on that wall and then get over to that wall to get to dick. I was not doing it correctly, is what I'm saying. Oh wait. There we go. It's like Zeldor. Just use the fire to make another portal. <laughs> you guys are funny. You guys are funny. There we go. Where do we go now? What? All right, chill. Chill. Let's chill. Oh, and there's the nether fuckers. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. I'll be fine. some platforming. Nothing I haven't done before. Oh. You can fuck right off. Alright. That's fine. Now. <laughs> okay. No, we're fine. We're fine. Well, ooh. Let's 
fine. Oh, why does it have to be like... Fuck off. <laughs> why is this so stressful? Alright, there we go. Don't fall. Go, go, go! <laughs> Damn. Oh, man. Fucking top-notch puzzle platforming. I'm... I'm loving this. Genuinely, I'm, I'm having a good time. Hi, chat. I'm now here for the end. Yeah, welcome, Subby. Welcome, welcome. I got a deep fridge, man. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, so we have to... So I was on the right path. Okay. So let's... Yeah, let's do that. That and that. Who's that? Ah, damn it. Oh, that works. <sighs> oh, man. Hmm. Oh, I see. Okay, wait. So I need to flick you, stun you. While I can do this. Jukes. Mad fucking jukes. Mad fucking jukes. Alright, there we go. Oh yeah, I missed the General Ultimax's battle theme is legit named Battle Against General Ultimax who has a tank. Yeah, uh... Rock Polish said that, so you're good. You're good. I, I It is a good... It is a good name. I, I appreciate it. It's good wordplay. Where I go now? Oh, I see. All right. All right. This is cool. I like. I like this. This is cool. Again, the puzzle platforming is my. Oh my god. No! Leave me alone. No, no. Run. I'm max level. I'm fine. I will be fine. Also, I love how it's just the ovens are just cranked up super high. That's awesome. Ooh, we did it! Besting those fierce flames by hitting a switch. All right, let's go meet up with the others. Oh my, you didn't take as long as I expected you to. Whatever, Queen Elizant, how's the roach? We sent him home when the flames were doused. There weren't many constructs, or there were many constructs, but we defeated all of them. Nice job. The Wasp King's gotta be up ahead for real now. Hearing he crossed those flames by himself, I'm still quite shocked. Ma Everyone, we must not falter. With our combined might, we are Bagaria's hope. Well spoken, Kabu. It's time for the final battle. Heh. <laughs> He's got no chance if we're all together. Yeah, even Mothiva should be able to help out a little. Excuse me? Don't doubt it, we'll pull our weight. Everyone, let's go. Crazy final boss time, it's fine. It's fucking time. More gaming. I don't know why, but the music right now is reminding me of a boss music in pick. It does sound like boss music, yeah. Yeah, it does. Alright. It's time to game. We're gonna game so fucking hard. What? Stop this instant! Your trail of violence ends here! Yeah, our trail of beating you up comes next. You're correct, Pitiful Ant. Today the fighting ends. For when I consume this sapling, you will have no choice but to squirm in fear and surrender to your king. You think you'll rule with fear? That you'll be happy that way? Or that the people will so quietly submit, or so quickly submit too, that works as well. Why yes, I'm sure. Do you not see my crown? No one cared about me until I put it on. Through power and magic, I became feared and respected. From weakling to ruler, I have never been happier. You're pathetic. You could never hope to be a true king. 
You will all perish today. Your opinion holds no significance to me. I wouldn't be so sure of that. Parry this, you crook. Enough fire to me! Ugh. Huh? What? Whoa! We're kind of alright. Could it be? Hm. I should have finished off Vanessa to think she'd give you that. We hope you're ready for our counterattack, Tyrant. I've been waiting all day. Everyone for our comrades, for Bulgaria! Oh, this is a bopping theme. Okay, immediately. Same strat. I treat this boss no differently. This guy's probably gonna have like 100 HP or something. So let's get ready for the long haul, folks. Wasp King, 105 HP. No defense. Thank God. Sweet payback. We've been waiting for a good few missions to bring karma upon you. Everyone, even though the flame brooch protects us, don't get careless. We cannot afford to lose. Alright. It's like nothing happened. Alright, ice rain. No punches pulled. What, he could be frozen? He could be frozen? What? Okay, this boss is... There's no... There has to be a second phase. I refuse to believe that there's not a second phase. I refuse, man. There's no way. Keep going. This is hard mode, by the way. I think we have enough HP to do another... Oh, let's do Ice Rain. I missed. I'm bad. I'm bad. Oh man, if one of those froze, that would be so good. Alright. Oh. Was not ready for that, but it's fine. It's fine. It's only four damage. Arch Villager and Wasp King have the same story. <laughs> Current theme playing as the Usurper, grasping for power. Aw, oh, man, such a good theme. We are we are already halfway <laughs> through. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna use V's turn to use a crispy donut. We're gonna keep her, yeah. Do that. Get some MP back. Shit. Oh, wasn't ready. Ooh, yikes. Alright, use this turn to heal. Alright, immediately I'm gonna... Sharing stash? 2 HP. Yeah. And then turn relay to Kabu. Just keep at it, keep at it. Slow and steady, slow and steady. We have good momentum. Does no damage. We're healing more, or at the very least we're canceling it out. Okay, no. Plus three, so we're good. Plus three, I think, is the max. So I think this turn... Ice Rain. I think we could... Yeah, wait. Aw. Oh, right, we use Kabu's turn. Crispy Donut. Oh, I could have just attacked. I'm an idiot. Hi, Bree. Give it up. You're outmatched. Not that tough without that fire, huh? I... I did not come this far to lose to plebeians like you! Can you just throw a bomb at us? Damn.
And now the real fight begins. Ah, uh, fuck. Please tell me we heal and we get our items back. That would be pretty cool. That would be neat. I was gonna say, because that fight was relatively easy. Oh, yeah, that's, that's real. Impossible. It's... it's wilted. After all this? It was... Hmm, excuse me. It wasn't that everlasting, huh? I reject this outcome! I refuse to accept it! Oh, he straight up eats the bitch. Okay. Gross. It's a Korok. He just ate a Korok. Stop being pathetic. You've lost. Come here and atone for your crimes. No way, that actually worked? I'm not going to scream. I have housemates. Yes, yes, this power will suit me just fine. I will deliver you to your doom. Crud. We've got to stop him here. He must not grow more powerful. Well, duh, we can't run away now. Together, everyone, let's finish this. Yeah, personal favorite theme of the game coming up, transcending, overpowering, everlasting. Ah, oh, God, that's awesome. All right, I cannot attack him while he's in the air. That's gay. Uh, well, same strat as before. We got all of our MP back. Did we get our items back? We have three crispy. Okay, we have three crispy donuts and a magic seed. We're good. We're good. Sharing stash. The everlasting king. This is it, huh? V, Kabu, thanks for all the good times. We can feel the artifacts. Let's destroy them as soon as they appear. We can't stop now. Oh, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Ooh, I like this theme. This theme is good. Kabu reminded me of Gino. God, five damage. That's half our health. Yikes! Yikes! Oh, man, I have to rely on... This is bad. Oh, dude, that gave him two burning! You bitch! V, you bitch! I have to use a nice fall. Yikes. Okay, well, it's fine. I don't like it, but it works. It's fine. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Okay, I'm an idiot. I I forgot that it has, like, cursor memory in this game, where if you, uh... Yeah, if, it, if you do do nothing on one turn, it stays on do nothing for some reason. I mean, I know why, but... Shut up. <laughs> shut, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Ice Rain. Seven damage, half health. We're winning. We're so fucking winning. <laughs> Play it safe, though. Play it safe. You don't win games. You don't, you know, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. Yeah, we're winning. We're winning. Granted, I think I might be extremely overpowered for this, but that's fine. Uh, I should take the time to get my regen back. So I'm gonna do that, yeah. Get the regen and then we'll do a donut. Take our time, take our time. Because he can do the fucking fire move at any point and I am not ready for that. go um i say i'm gonna do something i don't have enough mp for it fuck do i do something risky i 
for the funny. I'm so glad this boss only has 60 health because otherwise, god, it sucks because of the artifact gimmick. I have an idea. Ten HP. Okay, we got this. We got this. All right, I'm just gonna do a taunt. I'm just gonna do a taunt. We'll get HP back. It's fine. Yeah, we are. We should not be this highly leveled. Impressive, but with this power, I cannot fail. Fifty throw. Go fuck yourself. What the? He healed up. Team, don't lose hope. Oh wait. Fuck. There we go. I'm an idiot. I didn't I didn't understand that. Okay. So he's gonna get bullshit, huh? You're gonna get bullshit, huh? <laughs> alright, alright. Alright. No, 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 no. Okay, we have enough health. I think I can still do I will use leaf to Give that to Leaf. Ka Leaf will keep his stuff up if we do a crispy donut. Please don't tell me it's two phases. Please don't tell me it's two. Please don't tell me it's more than one phase. It's eight damage. That's half health already. Okay. It's half health. Chat, it's doable. Ah, that's a lot of damage. Okay, but it's good. It's good. Now we can... Yeah, we can do one more. <sighs> Shit, we still need to do another donut. It's our last donut. Pray to God I can hit these shots. No more healing, please. Ugh. Try as many times as you want. You will never defeat me. Are you kidding? Not again. We can't keep up. He can't keep healing forever. Keep attacking. Fuck off. Okay, so I have to thank God for TP core. I can't do the ice ran anymore. Although I really want to. Alright, Kabu can heal himself. We have to just do our basic... I think instead we do an ice... <sighs> oh, that's so much! <clears throat> Damn it, alright. Just, I can't have that stay. I can't have that stay. Okay. I only healed one. He only healed one. Okay, we got four TP back. Alright. Fuck. Okay, now it's the long game, folks. This is just gonna have to pray to God that my strat works. Fucking summoning both parts of the key out of nowhere. Alright, he's doing nothing now. He's doing nothing now. Alright. Fuck. Alright. Now we just have to play the long game. Yeah, we are out of donuts. Could have gone for more, but honestly, this is allowing the game to actually be challenging. <laughs> I think if I had some more donuts, this game would be way less dif way way less difficult. So I like having a bit more tension on this boss fight. <sighs> oh shit, okay. I have to knock him down, unfortunately.
I barely get enough to do a taunt every turn, so I have to, at the very least, just allow this to slowly go through. Good, good. That was really good. Really good. Keep on going! Keep going! By the skin of our... Well, not really skin of our teeth. We are we are basically alive. He can't kill us, if I'm honest. Okay. Doing good, doing good. Near the end, near the end. sale for eight dollars right now damn yeah please buy this game if it's on sale for eight dollars please buy it Ooh. oh i didn't i did block oh shit get him shit it's still locked him down still locked him down beef finish it off please be the final phase it can't be Yes! <laughs> yes! Have... Have we won? You... How dare you! You can't regenerate forever. Yeah, shut up and give up already. I... I am eternal. So what if you're strong? I am immortal. I... I am everlasting. I will take everything in this world. Impossible. After such a long fight, you won't concede. It won't end like this. It's over, vermin! This power is... Uh... No! It... It was meant to be... Infinite! No... Can't. No, I'm the king. I I order this body to. Ah! <gasps> what happened? What a pitiful end. His greed and cruelty led him to this. We got super lucky. Is it over? You really did it. Wow. Team Snakemouth, you saved us all. I truly thought we were doomed. So he's like a tree now? Is this also an everlasting sapling? No, there is no magic coming from him. He truly is just a tree, as V said. That's weird, why'd he transform? The everlasting sapling's power was said to be infinite. Was that a myth as well? There's nothing truly infinite, is there? My beauty? He was so strong, though. Perhaps he was simply unable to control his power. Maybe it was sealed for the safety of others. Can we think about it later, though? It's still dangerous here and stuff. Wait, V, what should we do with the tree? Perhaps we should strike it down, just in case. Lower your blade, Maki. Your Highness? It will remain as a symbol of our long struggle, of our journey for the sapling. A warning to not seek its power any longer. Can't we put like a cooler statue here or something? Like a Team Snake Mouth statue? No. <laughs> v, you've truly made this journey something else. You too, Kabu. We would not have... We would not have it any other way. You're not gonna get sappy in this dreadful dumpster, are you? Well, it's kind of emotional for me. Look, the Wasp King is gone and we have technically found the Everlasting Sapling. We should celebrate with a big show. Or at least rest. <laughs> well, it does sound good. We've completed our mission after all. But first, let us inform the Roaches of what has occurred.
Elizant. Yes, Leaf. Are you truly satisfied with this? Your mother will remain sleeping forever. Everything I said in the village was true. I would not place that wish over my people's needs. But no, I'm not satisfied. It was a sacrifice, after all. It was my duty. Thank you. You've grown into a fine... You've grown into a fine queen. And now we can say it for sure. Thank you too, Leaf. I can tell you served my mother and I earnestly, despite your doubts. Let's go. This is no place for us anymore. Lead the way, our queen. We say let it grow. So that's it then. The afterlasting sapling is no more. What should we do now, Elder? What are we meant to protect? This is still your ho oh, this is still your home, sapling or not. You can protect it with heart. But if you'd like to visit greener pastures, you are welcome in Bagaria. All of our kingdoms would have you. Bagaria. We've only heard the tales our ancestors left us. I fear I've grown too used to this small town and its scorpions. I will be okay staying here. Elder. Everyone, you are not bound to this land any longer. You need not fight monsters and forage for food, nor fear sleeping in case of an attack. You're free. Those who wish to go to Bagaria don't stay fearing for my sake. After all, you can always visit. Thank you. Thank you, our elder. No offense, but I'm out of here. I can't leave the scorpions, but thanks for offering. I'll miss mine, but I want to see the world. Our queen, you've caused quite a stir. It's because they can have adventures now, too. <laughs> Indeed. It makes me want to go beyond Bulgaria as well. Team Snakemouth, we depart. We have a feast to attend to. I trust you won't keep us waiting. Or I'll start the show without you. Don't doubt it. Well, I've got quite the report to write, so... I'll help you. We're not missing the food. <laughs> My thief is in quite the mood. I'm just glad we survived. All thanks to you. You helped us as well. It was truly a te- Oh my god, you helped us as well. It was truly a team effort. Let's work together again sometime. I like Zasp. My homies love Zasp. I like Zasp. He's actually like my favorite side character. I like he's chill. He helps out. But he's still a fucking simp! Ah, why can't he be nice with my thiever around? Don't know. Pride or something? As long as we know his true feelings, it's fine. There's a lot we want to say, but let's go celebrate. Heck yeah, I'm super hungry. Thank you, V. Leaf, for helping me experience the adventure of a lifetime. If my team could see me now, I hope they would be happy for me. More than that, they'd be proud. Yeah, you're a super explorer now. <laughs> no, just part of an incredible team. Now for our final mission. Let's head to the castle. <laughs> oh, crap. Battling through Rubber Prison and the Deadlands, Team Snakemouth discovered the Roach's Village. Resolving to destroy the Everlast... Oh, my God. How did I... Uh, it's the name of the game! How did I fuck it up? It, resolving to destroy the Everlasting Sapling, they faced the Wasp King with determination. <laughs> and so... After a long journey and many harsh fights, Team Snakemouth and their comrades defeated the Wasp King. Although the Everlasting Saplings chapter has closed, a new one begins. It's time to celebrate. This game's so fucking good, man. It's so fucking good, man. The Queen's gone all out with this celebration, has she not? It's great to see such a joyous mood in town. <laughs> All we've got to do is go with the super reward. Wait, the... I th I want to make sure that the ducking is still on. Okay, it is. We did it! Yes! <laughs> Leaf is still almost nine, but it is okay. Oh, victory lap. It's victory lap time. We I get to voice all the characters. Chat, here's the guessing game of let's see if Gab remembers all the fucking voices she did for the characters. Hey, thank you for everything. Let's enjoy the party. Thank you for making Bagaria a safe place. 
Team Snake Mouth, you inspire me to be super brave. <laughs> She's so happy now. I thank you once more. Wow, you didn't tell me you were a real superhero. Phew, I'm just glad life's gonna go on as usual. Everyone, I've run off to the palace ceremony. I'll run off to the palace ceremony soon. I just wanted to be the first to say you're awesome. What? Thank you, Chubby. That's rude, Kabu. How fucking dare... You took good care of the place, Fee. And of our land. Thanks. <laughs> it was nothing. I've gone out of stock. There's too many visitors. <laughs> That's a good problem to have, ain't it? Thanks for your patronage too, Team Snake Mouth. Yo, youngins did it! You've come so far! <laughs> Thanks, Chuck. Enjoy the feast. Oh god, my vocal cords are going to be shredded tonight, or they're going to be really good for the next game we play. You've done it. I fucking did it! Yeah! Also just going to let you know, because I don't think the game does, the Wasp King's name was Hoax, and was actually a mimic fly. What? I'm sorry. Huh? Huh? I love the ending so much, it's literally just you kick the villain in the balls a few times and he turns into a tree. That has to be the funniest fucking ending to an RPG ever, by the way. It's definitely one of the more interesting ones. The Wasp King's name was Hoax, and he's actually a mimic fly. Make sure to check the roof of Team Snake Mouth's house. Thank you! <laughs> Nero's having tons of fun. This is a splendid final stop. Wait, I want to go. Let's see. Roof to house. <gasps> oh, it's the Bandit King. Oh, wait, no! I want to see our little guy. No, I want to see the little guy. Oi! There's a party for the strongest, right? Nothing here, though. You can keep a secret, can't you? Just this once. Being in prison was hard. I'm gonna sleep for three months after this. <laughs> All these just a few contracts I brought for work for fun. I have not met this character. This guy seems cool, though. You're my heroes. Won't you sign my scarf? Seems I missed a ton while traveling. I'm Mar. Thanks for protecting my hometown. You're b my hit <laughs> heroes, so uh, I wrote you a uh, song. Check this out. All the bugs on the roof are dev Sona bugs. Oh, that's so cool. I was gonna say, because I know the grasshopper here is a, uh, he is the, uh, the music guy. He's the composer. All of these guys are, yeah. Puppy! Puppy, puppy! Epo. Oh, fuck you, too. <laughs> That's really cool. All of these guys are dev bugs. That's so cool. So sleepy. So hungry. Look, I'm your fan. Got lots of leisure time, too. But this party's making me late for breakfast. <laughs> what do you mean it's lunchtime? <laughs> Hell yeah. God damn it. I've been storing a special item for you. My super big thanks. Oh. Uncle Ironseed, I was told there was a party for the strongest, but Tanji's not here, and he's the strongest bug I know. Let it go, Kabu. Oh wait, which one? Oh, you two are my idols. Oh yeah, you two are my idols. Naturally, word of my skill was sure to spread. <laughs> God, you must polish your social skills, too. Thanks for always encouraging me. I hope my songs helped you, too. I... I'm so glad you're fine. You worry way too much. No one's going to watch a play on such a monumental day. I shall sit back and enjoy the show from backstage this once. Wow. The Ant, King the Ant Kingdom is beautiful. Traveling the sands is safe now, thanks to Team Snake Mouth. Hey, don't worry about the quest today. Have fun. Nothing like ceremonial duel. <laughs> Shame Ari couldn't make it. You traveled the seas to defeat the enemy. You're brave or nuts. I knew the Bug Rangers would save us. Oh my gosh. Uh, thanks for believing in us. But to have the party stool later. I forgot what I did for her. Boys! I've never seen such a variety of bugs. What an opportunity to market the Termicade. 
This is gonna be such a business boom. Thanks for all your patronage. I went to your place like twice, but I appreciate it all the same. I overheard some guards. It seems our kind may walk this land again soon. I'm so relieved. Seeing the world was great, but nothing beats coming home. Aw, the ladybug racism will end, and it's because of us. Let's go. Whoops, I left my lunch. <sighs> it's fine. They're handing out food later. After both invasions, I'm glad to see the peace. You didn't talk to Tangy in the house? I did talk to Tangy in the house. What do you mean I didn't talk to Tangy? Yeah, I did. Wait, there was a party for the strongest, right? Nothing here, though. Yeah, I talked to Tangy. Don't gaslight me, Rock Polish! Don't you dare! You will not gaslight me today, good sir. No, sir. The roaches live? I've got so much research to do. Mathiva, thank you for helping us. Oh, oh, it was nothing. <laughs> Thanks. Let's relax, shall we? There's a good mood today. Kapu, everyone! I've always known you could do great things. Venus insisted on coming to thank you. I must keep her hidden. Aria worries too much. Thanks for helping everyone out. We really did it, Team Snake Mouth. I think we're like better explorers thanks to you. We did it. I think we all need a vacation. <laughs> Nonsense, we must work together to keep the peace. Say, Leave, with the factory and this solved, need an examination? Let's, uh, let's say we figured it out. The professor didn't help me play, or didn't let me play spy cards with the others. Being professional sucks sometimes. I, I mean, thank you so much for everything. <laughs> uh, you should have told us you were protecting all of us. <laughs> I'll bake you a cake later. Make sure to come eat it. <laughs> yeah, Muse, that sounds great. Greatness runs in the family, eh? You've got to tell us about your adventures sometime. How about over next dinner? You got it, Pops. Hope you're ready for a long one. Oh, my uncle's so cool! Explorers are awesome! Ah, uh, um, thanks. All kingdoms and my family are safe thanks to you. Words aren't enough. No, not you. I feel quite calm. Thanks, Runs. Honestly, at my age, it feels like it's not my problem, but it's nice to th see things turn out fine. Ellie's so happy today. It's all thanks to you, nice kids. V, you're the best explorer ever, you know that? I'm gonna need a huge painting from the most talented artist in the Bee Kingdom. When you can't- when can you start making it? Bleh. <laughs> oh gosh, V, go to your ceremony already. V, Kabu, Leaf, the Bee Kingdom extends its utmost honor and gratitude. V, you've made me so proud. You've opened new frontiers for all bees. <laughs> yeah, I really did. I hope you'll come visit more often, my dear child. We couldn't quite transport Lyra to the ceremony, but she sends her regards. I do as well. Not you! Shut up! My people are free. I will never be able to thank you enough. You don't need to. It was the right thing to do. So humble. Please, I hope you'll visit our kingdom now that the dust is settled. Um... Let us start anew after the ceremony, yes? I'm ready for the ceremony. I'm ready. Uh, uh, uh. We did that in hard mode, by the way. Just want to let that be known. I'm very proud about that. We did damn good today, people. And in three hours, no less, too. We congratulate, we congregate to celebrate the brave efforts of all the explorers who protected our land. Many of them are here today, and I can't thank you enough. But there is so, so much more to be joyful for. The assistance of those who believed in us. The freedom of the wasps from their tyrant. The promise of reconciliation with the termites. And the closing of the Everlasting Saplings chapter. Oh, I got a burp. What's I didn't eat? <clears throat> Sorry. My bad. A new future for Bulgaria and the Ant Kingdom. Woo! Woo! Team Snake Mouth. 
Even though this is only possible due to the efforts of many, none can deny the great part you played in this campaign. Heh, <laughs> you know it. Be not now. Anyhow, it is my absolute honor and privilege to knight the three of you as royal blades for the service of our kingdom. May fame and glory come to you for your brave efforts. I wish I had my applause sound effect. Wait, I might. No, oh, it's going to peak. I'm not going to do it, but you know I want to do it. Everyone, tomorrow we work to become better than we are today. Also, you all have leveled up. Make sure to pick your stat increases uh, on your way out. I prefer the BP, but, you know, whatever works for you guys. Ah, shit! Ah! I hit something. Everyone, tomorrow we work to become better than we are today. But today we feast! Yeah! Let's fucking go! Yeah! All's well that ends well. We did it! We're like super famous now! <laughs> Let us face this feast with pride. Team Snake Mouth, move out! Uh, uh... No! So <laughs> it's over! It's over! I gotta crack my back. Celebratory back cracks. Oh, one second! There we go, and... Oh. All of that tension, three months of tension were just loosened in that back crack. God. Look at us. We fucking did it. Get heckin' credited, bro. Okay. I think this is where I do my closing thoughts. Genuinely, chat, I would say... Ah, Gabby finally woke up from your three-month coma. <gasps> I'm alive! I didn't die. I wasn't a bug. Holy shit. We are. <laughs> I'm back. I've returned. We're no longer bugs. Holy shit. I'm back. I can feel my face. I don't feel an exoskeleton. Holy shit. I'm back. Well, everybody. That was bug fables, everybody. Okay. So. I would say. I'm going to get my negative points out of the way. Because I only have, like, two. One, you've heard me say it before. Inventory management would have been fucking nice. Just saying. Better inventory management would have would have been so nice, but it is based on Thousand Year Door, and Thousand Year Door didn't also did not have that. So I understand if they were trying to, like, mimic that. It's, like, the one thing I wish they didn't mimic. Um, two, every now and then, controls are just a little finicky, but... This was not intended for console, it was intended for PC, so maybe, you know, that might have been something, I don't know. Regardless, um, after that, uh, Kabu, I wish Kabu's story was more fleshed out. One flashback would have been nice. One flashback, or just more, I wish it was less secret, and then it, like, builds up to him just explaining it for one cutscene, and that's it. That's kind of like, um, everything else, I really liked. Also, Jesus, look at all these people. <laughs> the true king was the sapling we bugged along the eternal. Damn right, angry artist. Damn right. Um, but yeah, I would say... Just overall, I really enjoyed this game. I would still... You know what? Fuck it. This is still a really good game, and I feel like I haven't scratched... The, I feel like I missed a lot of stuff. Uh, just because I feel like there's like some backtracking I could do. I would say for, okay, here's the thing. For an indie game, for an indie game that, you know, was for the most part trying to mimic a really well-known game franchise. So like the stuff that I have for the most part, except for Kabu Story is nitpicks. Kabu Story could be kind of written off that they just didn't have time. Uh, they're, they're indie devs, you know, what have you. Um... Just, I wish there was better item management. I wish Kabu's story was fleshed out. I know Kabu gets more stuff in the post-game. Uh, I know Kabu gets post-game story stuff. Still doesn't, uh, excuse the fact that I wish I got that in the main game. So that Kabu, by, by the time I reach credits, feels way less developed than V and Leaf. Like, Leaf had an entire dungeon. V had an entire chapter. Kabu had, like a portion of the chapter, and he had, like, one cutscene that kind of explained everything. The melody here uses older versions of some of the songs. Interesting! Interesting. 
The true bug we bugged was the bugs we bugged along the bug. Now you're making sense. Now you're making sense. Um, I would say as in, like, most of my complaints could be... Uh, I would say, genuinely, it is a small team and they did a fuck ton of good. Really good combat that I would say I prefer over Thousand Year Door. I would say the combat is way more engaging than Thousand Year Door, and I like that. I like how it's more of an in-depth battle system than Thousand Year Door. I think, I, you know, more, I think that is good. I think, in a sequel, I would like to see more party members that you could swap in and out to, like, pick your own set of three. I think that would be, like, my dream sequel for this game. My dream sequel for Bug Fables is a, is a next game where we get, like, six or so, like, party members, or we get, like, five, five party members, and you get to pick the three that you have in battle, or something like that, and, like, you, the different, like, kind of combinations of characters can, I like, I like the characters being unique, that is my favorite part, is all the characters being unique, neck the sequel i would kill to see like give me some more characters and then allow me to make my own team composition and that would just add to the goodness i feel i think that would be really fun i i think that would be cool outside of that um i missed the final boss i'm so sorry sarah it was really fun though uh outside of that i mean yeah this game's fun good challenge uh i don't know it's just overall I, i'd say this is a five a five out of five for me this is a personal five out of five I feel like it is a 5 out of 5 with some valid complaints, but no game is perfect. You know what? No game is perfect. I will say that. Um, but you know what? I would, yeah. No, overall, the game's really fucking good. I'm gonna give it a 5. 5 out of 5. Sky Leo, what's up, Sky Leo? I was here. The two bosses in the post game are terrifying. It's not the same. What was my favorite part? Uh, it's gotta be the Leaf Dungeon. I really like the Leaf Dungeon. That was a really cool thing to like figure out on my own or to like have that be revealed. I think just the lore implications of Leaf. I would say overall my favorite chapter. Ooh. I would say overall my favorite chapter was probably um I like the B chapter. The B chapter. I think that's chapter 3. Chapter 3 is my favorite because you get to do the desert, you get to find out about the thieves. You do the thieves and you even do... I think the desert area is the most fun because you spend the most time in it. And there's more secrets even like later in the game. That's probably my favorite area. And the hive is just a really cool concept. I like the honey factory and all the robots and stuff. But my favorite part of the game specifically, easily, is probably either... I'd say the card game. The card game was really fun to be like, Oh, spying actually like did something. It would probably be spy cards and the uh and the leaf dungeon that was my favorite those were my favorite parts sing a song a celebration uh okay here i beat bug fables i thought it was really good it puts me in a really happy happy mood the end of the game got really scary i got a bit scared i was a bit wary but we got to the end we defeated the wasp king and we now get to do some post-game things because we did really good and the hours um this game is really good it's got that power we're, we're playing with power bat 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 i don't know wait no it was four years technically my first playthrough of this game was over the course of like two to four years jesus modify by 11 demon get off the stage sarah how dare you Apologize right now! This is good music. Music in this game also is really good. Like, I'm humming along to like half of this song, like all the time. So, probably tomorrow, if I have time, I'll probably import the soundtrack and put it on the stream playlist because, like, this, this soundtrack fucks. This. Chad, I don't know if you know this, this soundtrack fucks. It fucks pretty hard. It's really good. If the if the if I would say this is going to be one of those devs that I really keep an eye on. I would say this is a game. This like game really. I'm gonna check. Suck Queen Amber. I'm good, thanks. I'm gonna check. It's like Moonstone Games, right? I'm gonna follow them on X, just so that I know what future games they come with. Uh, what is it? Moonstone. 
Shit, what? I guess just like bug fables. Paper bug dev. I'm following. Hell yeah. Hopefully that dev will have something. But yeah, uh, personal five out of five for me. This might be one of my one of my top five. Actually, chat, we do. I do. Chat, I do. I do need to actually fix my. Uh, I need to fix something. Um, I need to start writing all the games that I've played in 2024. I do need to do that. Uh, just like, can I not like duplicate? Oh, that's a shame. All right, let me set up a Google Drive that's or a Google spreadsheet. You're not listening to the best part of the song. I'm listening to it. It's just at the same time I'm typing something. Calm your tits. Calm your tits. I'm fine. Oh, wait, shit. The credits are done, though. All right, wait, because gameplay stuff. The end. It is the end. The end is and now. Damn. Good video game. Good fucking video game. You gotta sing modify? I'm chill. I'm I'm fine. Heh. <laughs> We're the best. Don't let the praise get to your head, V. Team, thank you once more. You said thanks like a billion times already. Stop. Uh, right. Sorry. You don't have to say sorry either. Alright, fine. I'm coming out and saying it then. I have a request. What's up? Last time we visited the wild swamp lands, it was, uh, most unpleasant. Yeah. But could we go there once more? I would like to visit my friends and let them know of our triumph. All right. Yeah, we can do that. Count on it, Kabu. Do you two have any requests as well? Nah, we're fine. Yeah, you've helped us enough. Let us pay you back. Let's go then. Would you like to save? Yes. All right. We will do that. Honestly, we'll do the Kabu quest. I think the Kabu quest is gonna be... Missed my last few messages. I... I... That... Yeah. Hey, right, one second. You're gonna do the Cape of 50 trials this stream? No! No! I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I'm EP. Uh... Bought the game in 2020. I didn't end up playing it until October 31st. I finished it in January. Finally, I did another full playthrough in February. Damn. Fun fact, the game is basically the composer's first... This game was the composer's first time making music for a game, which is insane. Yeah, because it's really fucking good. This game's soundtrack is absolutely amazing. It be... Oh, wait. Oh, my God. It became one of my... One of the OSTs I actively listen to. The only other one being Persona 5's, which is a very important game to me. That's awesome. You can't tell me what to do with my tits. I'll say what I want. <laughs> the credits thanked you and you didn't even see. Fuck you. Fuck you. Wait, boulders on the statue. Boulder statue. Fair, fair. Not doing the shit again. <laughs> Been awake since like 9 p.m. yesterday, so I think I'm going to enter a coma. Good night, Reed. Win or else, I will do the best I can. Ugh, all right, I know it already saved. Uh, we're gonna go real quick. I'm gonna add this to the uh, the shrine of my uh, my sh my shit. So one quick second, I'm gonna make sure I got this all set up. Apologize to my fridge. Your fridge is fine. It had your fridge had cool ice puzzles and it had a lot of tomatoes. Just because I said it had a lot of tomatoes, I wasn't saying that like it's a bad thing. Like if I joke about it, it was in an endearing way. I promise you. I promise you. All right, one second. Oh shit. Okay, wait. I'm not even. I'm not even alive in this one. Wait, where's my PNG? Where's my PNG tuber? Where was my PNG tuber? One second. <laughs> one second. I have to copy. The PNG tuber from this one, uh, if I can fucking find it. There we go. Theater tube mini copy. Go to browser. I love it when I completely forget to like get my folders done. Uh ch chat, you're still alive. Let's put on some music. There we go. 
It's Pikmin time. Pikmin music time. Uh, don't need Chrome audio. I do need Chrome video. We're gonna do some. We're gonna do some sheeting because I need to fucking type all the games I've played for the past week. Also, also, I'm streaming tomorrow. The Splatfest. If anyone's interested, yeah, check out Subby Space tomorrow if if you're willing. Sarah, Sarah, calm down. <laughs> Finished the entire Roblox egg hunt in six days. All 100 games helped me. Christ. I have played Pakunuku. Pakunuku is fucking good. I played that on Twitch. All right. So let's just say. Okay. So I usually have a. I usually have a spreadsheet of games played in 2024. Let me show you the one I had on 2023. Well, one second. Let me pull up the one I had in 2023. Can you guys still hear me? Okay. Just making sure. Alright. Here's like, I had like, basically it's the same thing. New games finished, completed, and here was like all of the fucking games I did. So basically I want to do that for 2024, just, just so that I now am on track of like what I have. I like doing this, it's fun. You can find the VODs on Curb Plus. Uh, you sh- yes. I don't know if the first- the first one should be on. I don't know if the finale one was. I don't remember. Thine voice is pr is pristine. Cool. <laughs> That's cool. Beat my head with a hammer. Alright, uh, so like, just played. Played. Never. Or just, yeah. Played. Finished and completed. There might be too many things to do. Well, luckily for you, my friend, I've got a song for you. There we go. All right, let me zoom this up. Can this? Uh, can I not? There we are. Hello. Let's just really zoom it in here. Yeah. There we are. The current window is too small to properly display the sheet. Shut the fuck up. Here. This is, this is a very, yeah, that's awesome. This works. <laughs> this is so bad. It's bad. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. All right. Make sure to post the stream in the member server. The stream will be at 4 p.m. Nice. Uh, make sure play Pizza Tower in 2024. Shut up, Sarah. <laughs> if Kerbisoid streams do have to come to an end whenever they have, we can have a Paldea Polka extended mix. Yeah, see, here's the thing. The thing with the Paldea Polka, I would have to like Pokemon Scarlet and Violet enough so we can say that we have finished Bug Fables. Bug Fables. Immediately. Bug Fables. All done. Let's say that. We've done all the main story quests, what have you. It's not completed. It's finished. Um, what the fuck did I play this year? <laughs> okay, what have we played this year? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, chat, I'm gonna need your help because I need to get another tab. There we are. Let me get a tab. By the way, remember that Bug Fables comic I told you about that I couldn't show you yet because it had spoilers? Well, now I can show you it. Please. If it's about that Mimic Fly shit, I would actually like to look at that. Let me see. Oh, Persona 3 Reload. I have played Persona 3 Reload. Good game, by the way. I just don't have the time to finish it. I, oh my god. What? A hundred. Alright. How do I do the thing that like allows it to like overflow? You know what I mean? It's been so long since I've done this. <laughs> Where's the thing that allows you to overflow? Text rotation. There we are. There we are. Nice. Okay. Actually, wait, no. The song would be named the Bulgaria Bossa Nova. Ooh. Ooh. I would have to get back into doing acapella. <laughs> I'm going to slam my head into a wall. Pop off. Sea of Thieves. Thank you. Sea of Thieves might, might take it. Skywalker Saga. Thank you.
chat is helping me today. Should I just post the silly comic in the gaming channel? Yes, and we will look at it uh, after we finish this lethal company. Thank you. Horse. What? Lego Fortnite. We're not putting Lego Fortnite. I refuse to put Lego Fortnite on that. That was very much a 2023 thing. Just personally. Technically, we played Smash. I'm not going to count that. I played Smash for like one day. That's uh, nah. Uh, no demos either. Uh, technically, <laughs> technically here. <laughs> West for Camelot. D B C. What the f <laughs> the Skywalker Saga? Thank you, chat, for bearing with me. I just want to make sure I actually work on this before I do this stuff. Rescue Team DX. Yeah, yeah, I'll count it. That'll help. Game Boy stuff, yeah. You played Reckoning at Gun Manor, which kind of counts as DLC. We technically completed that. I don't know. I think we've done... We did everything we could for that DLC, right? So technically, I can say we quote-unquote, completed West of Loathing. And just like in heavy asterisk, Monster Loves You Too, thank you. I forgot, we need to, oh, I can't do that. It's got a lot of stuff. Got a lot of copyright shit. Thank you, chat, by the way. I really, I genuinely appreciate you guys helping me do this. Uh, West of Loathing, basically everything possible in that save yeah like stuff i like i was locked out of technically it's like not everything possible in that save plus dlc very heavy asterisk on that but it, it, it technically it's completed me tuber tutorial that's not that's nothing that's literally nothing that's literally nothing. Uh, yeah, I think we're caught up. Ooh, chat. I could, I could play Princess Peach Showtime right now. No, 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 no. I'm gonna save that for Sleepazoid stuff. Uh, just also, I don't want to start a game and then immediately not play it because we still have, we have to play, uh, Citizen Sleeper. We're gonna do it. It's not now. It's too late. It's funny how I would be the one that remembered, but I barely remember much. Monster Loves You 2 was such a good game. It's a big shame it was so bad for streaming. I know, dude. It's insane. Ew, 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 ew. Princess Peach Snore Time. Subby, do you not know of a game called Kirby's Epic Yarn? Literally, it. not only that, it's made by the same people. I'm going to play Princess Peach Showtime tonight to calm myself. It's going to be chill. Pizza Tower, play it. I will not stop. Sarah. Sarah. Genuinely. I know you're joking. I know you're joking, Sarah. But please. But please. Please stop. Otherwise, we will time you out. I liked the chill game. Yeah, like, here's the thing. Selby, did you know it was made by Goodfeel? The same people that made Kirby's Epic Yarn? I didn't know that. I found that out, like, today. It just would be nice. Hey, Sarah. You're chill. You're, you're chill. You're chill like that. Yeah, I'm aware. I didn't know that. Was this just, like, I, I, I guess it was publicly, like, aware, like, publicly, like, available information, but I didn't fucking know that. I thought it was made by uh, Next Level. Because the animations looked really similar to Luigi's Mansion 3. Placid Plastic Duck Simulator, we gotta do it. How much is it on G2A? Cause I could I could fuck with that right now. Is it not available on Steam? How? There's no plastic duck simulator keys on G2A. 
that's gay. That's gay as fuck! Uh, yeah, I like, I like her current roundup. Uh, let me see, is there like a Switch game I've been playing recently? I'm gonna check. Gab, there's another Steam sale in two days. Wait, what? Oh, it was rumored heavily before release. Okay, so we didn't know that it was made by Goodfeel until much later. I'm not gonna lie, after playing Princess Peach Showtime's demo, and like near the end of the demo, I'm like, oh. Okay, I kind of like this. I can't, I'm kind of fucking with it. I was really like, and then I was like, oh, this reminds me of Kirby's Epic Yarn. Like, this just feels like a simple but cozy game. This feels like Kirby's Epic Yarn. Then to find out that they made that, and then I'm like, oh, damn. And this is a Switch game they made? Oh, man. Yeah, and they made Yoshi's Crafted World, didn't they? And I'm like, of, I'm of the very unpopular opinion that I kind of like the music. I like the I like the modern Yoshi music because it's silly. I think it's just funny. Ah, oh, damn! I might have to play Yoshi's Crafted World sometime. <laughs> Not my Duck Simulator. Didn't you play Spider Man? Uh, Spider Man was in December. That's the thing. I complete. Oh wait. No, you're right. I think Spider-Man Miles Morales would be... I think Miles Morales would be... Yeah, I finished that this year. Actually, yeah, you're right. Holy shit, yeah, you're right. Wait. I need to double check. Because now I'm curious. There we are. Uh, actually, yeah, let me check this real fast. Um... Fuck, I didn't even- Potion Craft! We've been playing- we've literally been pay, playing Potion Craft. Potion Craft fucks, by the way. Such a good video game. Such a good game. Spider-Man Miles Morales. Tw I started it the fina- Ooh. Oh, fuck. Okay, here's the thing. I finished it. I finished the game in, uh, as of December 30th, 2023. But then... But then... I, I platinum trophied Spider-Man Miles Morales as of January 14th. Wow, that's a good game. Uh, I don't, I don't have the biggest positive opinion on Spider-Man Miles Morales. Still a good game though. I will say. The Platinum Trophy- the Platinum Trophy is actually not as bad as I thought it was. I found Duck Game. All I say, Gab, is don't ever try to 100% Yoshi's Crafted World. Yeah, I was gonna say, I know 100%ing Yoshi's Crafted World is omega levels of repetitive. It is like very repetitive to 100%, but I never one- I never 100%ed, um, Kirby's Epic Yarn. I never did that. So part of me is like, oh, if it's like a very casual playthrough, then maybe... <clears throat> Sorry, god damn it. I drank Mountain Dew for like, what, an hour? Or like, I sipped like a, like three sips of that Mountain Dew and like my stomach has like... It's not letting me down. It's not, it's not letting, it's not letting me forget that, I guess. Also, I noticed I used actual... There we go. Um, I think that's everything. Uh, let's check the Switch, actually. Because I want to be 100% certain. I'm gonna use ya. Yeah, here. Uh, I have not played those. Those are just on my game switcher. No, I think I've been, like, very... I have not played my Switch much so far. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, because this was footage for the video. Yeah, no, I, I, I have not been playing my Switch much. Damn. Oh, that's the wrong one. That's for a completely separate thing. You just looked at my wall. <laughs> I'm happy to say I did, and I have it in my 100% belt. But man, one of the worst games I 100%ed by far. Yeah. I don't think I've ever 100%ed a game. Y'all are crazy. Nah, I just have, it's just, it, sometimes I get hooked to a game, and I stay hooked. Um, shit, what was I gonna do? Uh, wow, my brain just fucking blanked. Um, shit. Oh, chat. 
I already announced it. The, the Let's Play that has been uh, released to all of the $3 members and up, they have early access to it until Tuesday when it's just publicly available to everybody. Uh, I started playing Cold of of the Lamb. There we go. I think that's everything, so... How many is that now? Okay, well, that's not what I wanted. So, so far, already in 2024, I have played 12 video games. <laughs> that's already a quarter of the games I played last year. <laughs> Please play the duck game. The, Ten the Nintendo Switch has no games. Nintendo has forgotten about Nintendo. It's insane. It's just, I... Okay, I got my PS5 on Black Friday. I've been playing the PS5. That's it. I've been playing the PS5, then I started my new job, I haven't played games much, and then I had, like, my PC. I've been playing some... This is, like, the first time I've, like, played PC games on, like, casually with Potion Craft. But it's a good excuse to play a relaxing video game. That's what I like about Sleepazoid, is it is a side project that directly helps my mental health. <laughs> it's nice. I do because I like the challenge of it, and it's why I love Pikmin so much, because I think it's fun to get everything while also thinking of the best way to get everything in under, like, a Pikmin day. Please play the duck game? Look. I haven't bought it. I haven't bought it? I am not- I'm not Little Miss Moneybags, I assure you. I will try to find it on Steam. I will look it up. I could fucking type. Oh. No, not Poppy Playtime. Oh, it's like two dollars. What? It's a two dollar video game. Oh, damn, you can get the fucking bundle for... Okay, I'm not buying the bundle. We will play base game... Placid, Placid, du Placid Duck, Stimmy... What a stimulator. <laughs> I don't need to stimulate a plastic duck. Fuck it. Fuck it, you guys. Fuck it. Fine. Just because I need something to kind of chill out. Uh, I need a new card. One second. I got to put in my, my number. Got to put in my number. I got to make sure I'm not fucking reading out my card. I'm... Hmm. Also, this lo-fi mix by Nakosh or er, by Sakura herself. This is just done by her. It's really good. I was hoping to do something for Sleepazoid, but this also works really well. I think that is all the wacky digits on the back. Alright. I agree. Let's just say I try my best to, you know, abide by my, uh, you know. Oh my god, it's not even a... Jesus. Alright. It's installing, it's installing. You freaks. Duck simulator for Sleepazoid? Shit, I didn't even think about that. This is just an investment in a Sleepazoid. Therefore, well, it's not a monetized channel, so I can't write it off of my taxes. Pixel sprites are too hard to make. Bro, pixel sprites are fun, though. I'm gonna eat my hat. Uh, to be fair, all the games I play either have way too many collectibles or have overly hard bosses that I'm not willing to bang my head against the wall for. Closest I've gotten is my 95% run of Persona 5 Strikers. Ye. Yeah. I would say the first video game that I have ever fully 100% completed was Super Mario Odyssey. I know he's problematic. Um, I'm not saying that, like, I still look up to him nowadays, but when he was still a person to look up to, um, I was really inspired by the completionist and, you know, uh, you know, nowadays not so much, but, you know, that was back when we didn't know everything. But I'd say still, like, base concept, he inspired people to just kinda, just enjoy, like, not kinda, I don't know, I'm not one to, like, he has taught me to not really I, I'm separating the lesson from the teacher, like, let, let that be known, but it, he has taught me to kind of savor games and not kind of just play a game, finish it, and immediately move on and not think about it. 
even if I'm not gonna 100% it, I'm still like, oh, I wanna tackle as much side objectives as possible. I wanna bask in the scenery. I wanna, like, enjoy as much as I can. So it's that. Eh, eh. Gab, if you wait until, like, Sunday, it'll be 50 cents. Too late. It's too late. I already paid two dollars. It's fine. If anything, I'll use the sale to buy all the DLC. I would rather wait for the DLC to be cheaper. I I'm fine. I don't. I don't care. I don't care. Uh, but good idea, Doctor Narwhal. I don't know why I didn't think about that. Time management games are stressful, but they also drive me to beat them. I'm assuming Pikmin. Uh, yeah. I never 100. If I ever 100 percent a game, it would have not been a monster. It would. <laughs> It would have to not be a monster collector, not have 200 plus of a collectible, and not have new game plus required for 100%. So every oh, still be a very special game to me. Yeah, it's uh, platformers are probably what I would do to 100%. It. But yeah, I don't know. I I just I like things where it's like it's a checklist, and it's like yeah, th that's what. Okay, I would say one of the best games to platinum, uh, at least like a PlayStation game, to 100% easily marvel spider-man like the original such a fucking good story fucking amazing content it is i love it i still need to play spider-man 2 at some point um now that the update is out as well i can feel like i can play it uh i don't know it's like so much about the original spider-man is so i mean again of course i'm saying it because like fucking it was the best game i played last year like i i, I know the bias is i know that the bias exists trust me All right, it's time. I need to get the oh wait shit, get that out of the way. Um, one second, I gotta. There we are. Uh, let me get everything working. Oh shit, <laughs> why? Oh god, everything is so unorganized. One second, I'm sorry. Wait, where's my? Where's the PNG tuber? God damn it! Wait, I still had it copied in the clipboard. Fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. All right. I need to go to Steam. Go to Steam Audio. Get Placid Plastic Duck Simulator. Get the filters. There we go. And then Steam Video. Placid Plastic Duck Simulator. There we go. There's multiplayer? I ain't doing that. This is good as fuck. Well. Right, let's... Uh, do we want the mouse or not? Nah? I don't know if the mouse really does anything. Hmm. Trying to 100% a Skylanders game would be hell. Yeah, because you would have to, like, especially... I always say this because I find it fucking baffling. If you were to try to 100% just simply collecting the original Skylanders at the time, at the time when everything was, like, $10 a figure, it would have been $200. Shit is insane. I can join you. Oh, well, let me make a new one and not show it to the, I'll, I'll clip, I'll copy it and then I'll send it to you, Eli. Wait, no. One second. Wait, no, what? It's okay. Even with the stand-in cards of Skylanders data you would make nowadays, it would still be a lot of tedious crap, yeah. Alright, uh, let me go to the Discord. And I will put the disc- So if anybody else has Placid Plastic Dunk Simulator, I'm gonna put it in the game chat if you wanna join on the Discord. Let me know. I'll have members play, I guess. 
Reed sent me. Gonna try. Ooh. Okay. I might be doing some Sea of Thieves this weekend. Maybe. Oh, okay. Interesting rock polish. Interesting. Huh. Okay, I, I, I checked out the, the, the comic that... Oh my god, why does this look kind of ugly? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Very high. V-Sync off. Fuck that shit. Oh, no. Names off. Eh. Yeah. Much better. Look at that duck. So true. Alright. There we go. Duck game. Alright, let's go to collection. What are we calling this duck? What are we calling this duck? I'm gonna call him... Charles. Charles the duck. That's Charles right there. Why am I... No. That's not your name! Your name is Charles! <laughs> your name is Charles! So true, Charles. Duh! <gasps> Eli connected! Oh my god, he's a fucking big duck. Look at that. You're a golden duck. Look at you. If you get a sheep duck, can you name it Shuck for me? Alright, alright. Oh, oh, I got bone duck! I got Beetlejuice duck! Oh, it's just a skeleton duck. Uh. Sans. Under quack. Sans under quack. So true. So true. You need to be on single player to see the names. I think it's just the first duck. Uh, any other duck. I think it's just the first duck that I drop into the pool for some reason. That's my duck. Oh, yeah. Wholesome video game, everybody. Uh, let's put the music up. There's a new Beetlejuice movie coming? What? There's a new Beetlejuice. Oh, okay. Chat, 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 chat. Thank you for the kind of like sort of related thing. Um, Chad, has anybody watched X-Men 97? Has anybody watched X-Men 97? That shit is so good. I really like X-Men 97. I will admit the animation looks a little jank sometimes. It looks a little jank sometimes, but like... It doesn't really matter. I really like it. Switch to hotspot. Ooh, oh, I'm on a chair now. I'll just leave that while I figure out the controls. Press Y to stop duck spawn. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Move cursor, unlock cursor, duck, hotspot, duck sound, emoji. Oh, all right. Look at that. Look at all our ducks. Can I zoom in? Cannot. <laughs> That's evil. You can uh, press middle mouse and you can play it. It's going to be named Beetlejuice Beetlejuice. Oh, that's good. That's good. Ooh, new duck. Wait, new duck. New duck. How do I get to the duck? Get out of the hotspot, you fucker. Oh. Oh, this guy's fucking awesome. Ooh, wait. Hmm. Goldie. Oh, wait, shit. I'm on caps lock. Goldie. Squawks. Uh. Baller ass. <laughs> Baller ass. That's him. That's my that's my duck. Baller ass. <laughs> Name him fucking awesome. I think it's the same thing. Same thing gets across. 
But uh, yeah, I would totally recommend X Men '97 if anybody here has Disney Disney Plus. Um, just in general, it's just it's so good. And I watched like the first three episodes of the original X Men show. It was not for me. Just being completely honest, the animation is old. The writing is very old, and the big cast of characters feels like it's just an excuse to make more toys. X-Men 97, I don't care if you pirate it, however you find it and you want to watch it, go for it, I'm not your dad. Um, X-Men 97 is really good. I really like the animation quality. The first fight scene in the show is like really fucking good. It's really good. Oh my god, I forgot Disney owned X-Men now. <laughs> yeah. I wish I had this game. Well, it's like $2. What do you mean you wish you had this game? You wanted me to play it! Oh, okay, get play, but still. Hmm. But yeah, look at uh, look at us. Is the wait? Is that even working? I can't even tell if the. Hmm. You know you're broke when you can't afford the two dollar duck game. Yeah. I hit a personal goal where I have saved a good amount of money. So for my weekly budget, I decided to buy a duck game. Oh my god, who is that? We got a new duck. We got a new duck. Who is this guy? Oh wait. Oh, it's a kiss duck. Look at that. Ooh. Look at this little guy. Strike. You feel like a strike. I don't know. This feels like a. This guy feels like a strike to me. It looks like he would strike. Oh wait, Sand Underquack. They might be going on the slide soon. Oh wait, strike's going down the slide. Let's go. Ah. The slide is cool. I am cool. Damn right, Strike. Pop off, man. Oh, is he immediately gonna get back up? Bro, this is your private pool, bro. Come on, chill. Chill, bro, chill. Should I get the DLC for the game? I don't fucking know, man. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Anything else happening here? No. Oh. Cruise ship? Oh yeah, cruise ship. Look at that. Huh. I I hope that there are speedruns of this game. I hope that happens. Whose golf ball is that at the bottom of the pool? That would be Eli's, probably. If I can get two yeses, I will buy duck game. Well, that didn't take long. And we're getting new duck. I posted the room ID in the gaming chat of the Discord, so if you wanna if you wanna join. Although I don't know if you're gonna get uh Oh Hell <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh like bam. Let's see who joins. Let's see who joins, baby. Eli, how could you drop your golf ball in the pool? Get to slide any percent? Oh <gasps> wood duck! Actually, I think that's a poo-poo duck. Chad, is this a mud, a mud, a mud duck? Matt Mud Duck. Oh, that's his name. That's his name. Matt Mud Duck. Isn't Matt Murdock like Daredevil or something? I don't remember. Chad, I need to remember. Hey, all you people. Hey, all you people. Hey, all you people. Yeah, Matt Murdock is Daredevil, right? Yeah, Daredevil. Man, I remember more about comic books than I thought. Actually, wait, where's, uh... 
Strike's still in the funny pool. Yeah, look at him. Hell yeah. No, I want to get a good, like, shot. Oh, Matt Mud Duck might be joining. Yo, wait. There you go. Just check out Strike for a bit. Mudkip, if it has... If it was true to the name. Oh, yeah. I thought I was getting a home run. I can't get Duck. I already spent 20 bucks today getting Monster Hunter. You got the worst purchase, man. I'm sorry. No, I'm kidding. I... Whatever. <laughs> also, if you listen to the radio, the new the news will come on talking about lore in this game. Interesting. Actually, just realized I can, in fact, not buy Duck Game because my card is already prepped for the Steam sale. How do you know what's on the Steam sale? Oh, oh, we're getting a bunch of people on the pool. Sans under Quack, Strike, and me are in there. I'm buying birthday presents for a friend. Aw, look at you. This is the real cult, not the stupid lamb. Hey, don't you dare talk about the lamb cult like that. Oh, man, Sans Underquack and Kerbazoid really did not want to be there. They saw Strike was there and they're like, nah, I'm going to take a strike and leave. Oh, wait, is the, uh, that's oh, getting like relatively closer. All right, everyone's leaving. All right, I'm gonna use you as a. Trying to get like a good angle, you know? Oh, ooh, Nuduck! Nuduck, Nuduck unlocked. What are you? Ooh, electricity. What should we call you? Oh wait, shit, I picked the wrong barrier. Oh, that that's a cool looking duck. What do we call this one? I'm planning to buy Pizza Tower on my non-existent computer, so yeah, I said, ah, oh. Looking for money currently. Ah, fuck, I just popped my ankle again. Yellow granite duck. All right. Not really the most, you know. I think I just called him Yellow Granite. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Yeah, it's fine. No, that's fine. That's his name now. <laughs> Fucking yellow granite fuck. <laughs> that's not what I meant to do. I accidentally called him. No, I accidentally called him yellow. I tried to type duck, but F, the F and D key were close together. So I, I accidentally called him. I accidentally called him yellow granite fuck. That's staying. That's staying, man. That's staying. When you get the stone duck, you have to name it bull duck. Oh, fuck. We're chillin'. Dude, these ducks, they're chillin'. We got gamer ass and then yellow granite fuck. <laughs> That's so bad. That's so bad, dude. Uh, this game would be perfect for Sleep as a Wait. I think I would genuinely be helped by this. All right. Here's the thing. That's basically me just leaving duck, leaving the duck game. But I guess that's fine. Did you guys see Mario Maker 1 was officially beaten? I I did hear about that. That's really cool. I'm really happy that 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 was like a big that's a big fucking task, you know? So, oh, Kerbazoid immediately going right. Back. Oh, wait, no. Let's go. The exclusive club. Oh, yeah. Yellow Granite fuck gets to gets to stay for the fun. Hey, I need to get a good angle. Bam. Nope. Come on. Eli! Welcome to the secluded pool. Yellow granite fuck just immediately was like, oh god, they're on the camera. They're looking at me. I don't wanna. I god damn it, I wanna get a good angle to like leave it on, you know? Uh yeah. That's pretty good. Duxim and Potioncraft are both active enough to tire out my brain further and also slow enough for me to fall asleep to them. Is there a blue duck? Can you call it Sonic the Dug Hog? Oh, that's pretty good. Or the Hedge Duck? Did you guys... Uh, when's this sale? I think it's in a few days. It's in a few days. Oh, 
we got Gay Duck. Sorry. It had to happen. It had to happen eventually. Look at that. Chill, chill ass gamer, you know? I took a screenshot. Chad, I took a screenshot. That's just gonna be there. Okay, Gab, it looks like five. I took like five hours to get all the ducks unlocked, but I also think the duck meter goes up faster because I'm here, I think. Interesting. Interesting. Name the next one Trump, no matter the circumstances. Hard pass. <laughs> Hard pass. Can you name the next duck subby space so I can be there in spirit? See, that I can do. Good. The vibes are good. I guess since we have like basically nothing, we have like basic like visual stimuli happening right now. Uh, do people, what do people got any questions for me? Because it is, I guess we are entering the third year of Kerbazoid. Does anybody have any questions regarding the next Let's Play, regarding streams, regarding what have you? I am more than willing to answer questions. I'm vibing because we'll probably end the stream in like. Yeah, seven minutes, probably. I don't want to stay up too late. I got, I got to clean up tomorrow. I got to do more cleaning. Gave you one of the rare ducks, the golden one. It's usually the last one you get. Let's go. Hell yeah. Oh, that's a good, that's a good camera angle game. You should, yeah. Don't quit your day job. I'm not touching anything, by the way. This is like an automatic camera that it does. Are there any games in mind that could possibly be use the Gab Right model? Ooh. I don't know. Honestly, Chad, I'm... I might use it for the uh, Citizen Sleeper. Doesn't make any sense, but I think it would be, it'd be chill. I'd like to think that in Kerbazoid lore, Chad is just a robot tied to a chair sitting in a corner and constantly yelling random shit that's occasionally on topic. How long will Duck Sim exist? Like, as a waypoint? I don't fucking know. No, you're fine, Emerald. Uh, I don't know what I would use it for. I might use it for Citizen Sleeper just for the simple sense of, uh, I'm fine using my own model, but at the same time, you did go out of your way to make it. I just don't know if it would like fit the vibe of Citizen Sleeper, but it's the only game. It's like this. It's going to be the next. Well, I say, here's the thing. When it comes to stream games, I give it a month. I give it a month and we see how it goes. If people are more interested to see how it goes during that month, like past that month, like Bug Fables, then we keep going past that month. But if not, then we'll play it. Then we'll do a different game, you know? Uh, but yeah, I'm fucking, I'm chill. I'm chill right now. Did another duck appear recently? Yeah. Oh, that's a Dia de los Muertos duck. Yes. Yes. I love Dia de los Muertos. That is one of my favorite holidays. No shit. I love Dia de los Muertos. Fuck yeah. Peak. Peak duck. That's subby. This is subby based. All right. That's subby based right there. Coco. Could have just said Day of the Dead. I love Dia de los Muertos. It is one of my favorite non-American holidays. It is my favorite non-American holiday. Like, hands down. I love Dia de los Muertos. It's so good. It's just the idea of just, just taking a day to celebrate the dead. I think that's cool. I don't know. I find the concept of such a thing to be very interesting. We should do another Liao next Friday, me thinks, so we can start Citizen Sleeper fresh in April. Probably, I guess. I don't know. I wanna I wanna play Citizen Sleeper. I don't think we need to like wait for the month to start. We can do Liao like on a 
if people are wanting to do another group canvas, we can just do a group canvas on Monday or Wednesday. You know what, since you said Coco, favorite Pixar movie? Oh, that's hard. Um, First one off the top of my head, Finding Nemo. I like Finding Nemo. That's a good one. It's a classic. It's the one that I grew up with. Uh, that in Toy Story 2. I like Toy Story 2. I think Toy Story 2 is a good one. Um, that would Those would be my two, because those are the ones I grew up with. Toy Story 2 and Finding Nemo. Toy Story 2? Yeah, that's good. I like it. One day we're not going to have any ideas for a Monday-Wednesday stream, and Gab will finally be forced to play random cool math games. One of these days. One of these days. I want a duck named after me. Alright, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I highly love Wally. Oh, Wally's good. I didn't grow up too much with Wally. Um, it was funny doing Hello Dolly, which is the Get out your Sunday closer, thoughts of world out there. It was fun doing Hello Dolly, doing that song uh, during high school, during the musical. It was like our spring, or no, it was our fall musical at the time, doing Hello Dolly. And it was so cool because I was like, oh, that's the song from Wally. The Incredibles is really... Yeah, The Incredibles is good, too. Again, I just didn't grow up with it. Um, like, I watched it every now and then, but... Alright. I think that's a wood duck. I think that's purely wooden. Yeah, that's you. That's you. There you go. I miss any ducks. Near. There you go. My favorite movie is Subspace Reality. God damn it. Wally is one of the prettiest Pixar movies. I'm not, yeah, I, I'm not disagreeing with that. Um, it's just, yeah, I, I think it's good. I think definitely the ones that stuck to me the most were, were Finding Nemo and Toy Story 2. I'd say those are like tied for me. Hey, right, counter question. Chat, what is your favorite Disney Renaissance movie? What's your favorite, like, Disney 2D animated movie? No 3D animated movies. We'll do, like, that's a separate question. We can ask, we can ask that later. 2D Disney animated movie. What's your favorite? I want to hear some. Favorite movie by far is Ghost... Ooh, Goofy movie. That's a good one. I watched that a fair amount of times as a kid. I really did. That's uh, it's definitely not one. I, it's one that I, I need to watch again. Cause I remember. That one was like that used to be, <laughs> clearly not enough to for me to remember the words. But I, I used to love that that song. It was stuck in my head all the time. The iron. That's not it. Is the iron? There's no 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 no. That's WB. That's WB. That's not Disney, but cl close enough. Big things only happen in big places. Curbazord. Ooh, Treasure Planet. That makes sense because people have been wanting me to do a Treasure Planet movie night. I, That makes sense. I actually have all the songs from the Goofy movie in my Spotify playlist. Oh! I think if we do Placid Plastic Duck, Plastic Duck Simulator... We do one where it's like, we get the full set of ducks, and then we do like, uh, like a bunch of hours. Like I'd say, I let my computer sit for like three hours, record that shit. That's the video, and then I like every now and then I'm like, okay, I'll buy another DLC and all, and then we'll do the same thing all over again. I think that'd be interesting. We've been waiting for Treasure Planet movie night for a year. Yeah, well. <laughs> Whenever I have a free night, I'll let you know, but to be fair, I've been, like, every time I have a free night, I tend to stream it. <laughs> until, until I have free time again, I, I, the movie night no happen. I'm sorry. I'm impressed that I can even, like, put a message in the Discord, like, once a week. That's just who I am. Like, I'm just impressed that's even possible for me. My expectations for myself are very low. Duck stream for Sleepazoid. Not a stream, but I would do like hour long, like an hour long recording for Sleepazoid, and then we like 
but I'm not going to do like multiple recordings of this exact same thing over and over, you know? It's either the Goofy movie or Mulan. Mulan is a good pick. Red. Uh, let's see. What do we pick? Crimson is Crimson. Crimson was the first one. I like Crimson. Crimson's good. I don't know if I've ever seen any of their 2D movies because Lion or besides Lion King, since I saw it like a couple weeks ago. Reed and Dark Rat forced me down and held my eyes open to watch it since I never saw it. Slimy yet satisfying, man. It's pretty good. It's a good movie. It's fine. Okay, my favorite. My favorite, easily hands down, is Hercules. Not only is the story, I love the story of Hercules. The music is so good. Slouch, do you want to be the Red Duck? I can make you the Red Duck. You're crimson. You're the Red Duck now. Name it Dead in the Pool. No. <laughs> I want to be a duck too. Doodle, damn it. Okay, wait. The next one will be Doodle. The next one is Doodle. Ow. Um, the next one will be will be Doodle, no matter what it is. If there's a green one, can it be named Emerald? I see I have entered a conundrum, uh, but but uh, my favorite 2D Disney movie is easily Hercules. The music's just so good. One of my favorite songs of all time is Go the Distance. It is a very big motivator for me just in life it's a song i love so much it's a very personal personal attachment to it it's good i like it so the reason why i said the iron giant was because it was the only one i can remember that was 2d animated we need a wasp king duck i okay well when you when you find me a duck that has a mimic fly on it uh be sure to let me know pal make him the wood one because tree but you you were the wood one you're the wood one. If Here's the thing. You want me to make that the Wasp King? Well, make a wish. What else could I possibly want? Oh, is it like a starry? Starry sky? Starry sky out? Shooting star? No. Oh, damn. The pool is like filling up, man. Look at that. Look at all those people. They're chilling. Oh, this nice circular pool. Everyone's kind of chilling, bro. Make me another one. That's not. That was not. Nah, nah. I'm holding your thing here. We're going to make a compromise. Either you're the wood duck or the wasp king's the wood duck. There is no additional ducks. You make your choice. I'm not taking more than one suggestion, pal. Gun to your head. Do you want the wood duck to be swap me for Wasp King? All right. All right. You made your choice. I do think a lie. A lie. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you use your emojis at me? But I want a duck. To that was not nah. I told you. Which one you want? What the fuck? Oh, I got that too. Hell yeah. Oh, new duck. Alright, who wanted a doodle wanted a duck? Ooh. Daisy doodle. That's not a daisy. Is it a da Wait, no, that's a daisy, right? Could be a daisy. Daisies are white, right? Daisy doodle. That's you. All right, angry. If we find one that fits you, we will. But just for now, wasp king. I wanna no. Let's go where the party's at. Jack. Okay, that's a lot of. That's loud. I'm a good cookie. Gab, you want to know a secret? I'm telling you, my friend, telling me a secret in a chat room of at least like five people 
not much of a secret but i will i would be happy to 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 be to burden anything you need i'm here i'm chill hello Tell me the secret. I'm here for secrets. I can handle it. This is actually really relaxing. I feel a lot calmer than before I entered the stream again. Well, what do you think? I'm chilling. Yeah, I need this game. I'm pro- yeah, I'll do some Sleepazoid content on this. I want to wait until I have all the ducks in like unlocked, and then what we'll do is I'll just- I'll have them all on the pool. We'll just have- I'll just have everything unlocked, I'll have all the ducks unlocked, wait for the ducks to be unlocked. And then afterwards what we do, is once I have them all unlocked, like kinda like, just kinda leave it, just have it start recording, leave the PC on for like three hours straight, have that be the footage. <laughs> That's Sleepazoid. I'll get the DLC with you. Okay. loud very loud i don't think the ducking is working at all why is the why does the ducking like never fucking work i never understood that It's not working. I hate it when this fucking... I love it when my, my fucking settings on... Yeah, you gonna work now or not? It doesn't work. Why does the fucking mic ducking settings never work? I no I swear. There's already plenty of ducks on the screen. I don't see the issue. We're gonna have all the members in the server when this is all in Sleepazoid, but instead of avatars, we're all ducks. Hey, that's an art prompt if I've ever heard one. I think that's a good fan art prompt. If anybody needs something to draw. Oh, wait, what? Oh, there's a new duck. Ooh, plaid duck. That's not plaid. Where are you? What is this thing? Ooh! Chrome duck. All right, this can be angry. There you go. <laughs> I thought the fucking duck brapped. <laughs> I was like, brah. All right, wait, is this, I can't tell if the fucking audio, I can't, I can't tell. I'm losing my fucking mind, bro. I just want to know for a fact if the audio ducking works, but I don't- I can't tell if it is or not. Like, how do you know for sure- I can't. I can't. This fucking thing? <sighs> Imagine if one day you woke up, went to your pool, and saw like 20 ducks in there out of nowhere. I asked about a kibble redesign a while ago, so I just came up with one on the top of my head for the goofy animation I made. Hey. Oh, I see. I still gotta I gotta lock in on the new kibble. Yeah, I was gonna say Subby is is high on the work on that. Name the next duck Sir Rizzler or of Gyatville. Oh god, I feel so cringe. Well you, you my brother in Christ, you you pressed the buttons to type that. That's all on you. And <laughs> do not. <laughs> I concur. I I concur. You can't just be like, oh my god, that was so weird, guys. When it's like, my brother in Christ, you fucking typed it, bruh. There's no one I'd- no like... I'm cringe. 
And that's based. I do not care. Well, clearly not, because you typed it, my friend. The lack of care was, was quite evident, I assure you. Gab, you see the pink flamingo floaty? Soon it'll slowly join all the ducks in the pool since it felt left out. But then later, one of the other ducks will kill it because it takes too much of the pool. That's evil. Why would they do that? That's evil. Why would they? I think the, the, the ducks, they seem... They seem innocent enough. They seem innocent enough. Going to sleep. See ya, artist. You have a good night. Mm. Mm. God, ow. Alright, I gotta figure out how to fucking get the... I think it's just OBS is fucky and it's not letting the settings work. Curb is telling their duck kid to not be cringe. What a good parent. <laughs> My head is sleepy, but the ducks are relaxed. Okay, chat, I'm gonna- I'm gonna close. I'm gonna close OBS for just, like, the- the most fleeting of moments. I'm gonna see if that works. I'll be right back. One second. Oh, no! Wait. I gotta make sure a setting doesn't work. <laughs> I gotta make sure a setting doesn't turn on, because, yeah, that's bad if it does. Can I please turn off auto stop? Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna turn off auto stop. I'll be right back. One second. Okay, hello. I think it's working. I can't tell if the mic ducking is working, but it's fine. Uh, we got- Oh, we got the propeller! We got the propeller bird! Let's go! No, you know what? You know what's gonna help? You know what? You know how I'm gonna know? If this worked. It's like barely fucking working. I don't. <sighs> OBS, it only works when it wants to. I don't get it. I don't get it, chat. I don't get it. Name it Timmy, little Timmy. Timmy, Jimmy. I'm seeing. I'm seeing more Timmy than Jimmy. Uh, we'll we'll name it. Little Timmy. Okay, chat. Okay, chat. I'm gonna genuinely ask. When I talk. <laughs> chat. When I talk. Does the does the game like lower in volume? I can't tell. It's it's supposed to, but I can't tell if it gets quieter or not because I don't have it. That's nah, fine, whatever. As long as it doesn't like overpower my audio, it's fine. Why is little Timmy over there alone? Because he flew his little ass over there. That's on him. I can tell a little. Little Timmy is a free bird. No, he escaped the pool. He's gonna suffocate. He's chill. He's little Timmy, bro. Leave little Timmy alone. I can't. I can't tell because it's just ambient here. One second. Loud music. The loud music is playing right now. But when I talk, does it like remotely lower at all? It seems like it's lowering about like five decibels, which is fine. It's like as long as it like brings it down to like a, a listenable. Uh, like audio it's fine it's just so that when I talk it lowers a bit so that you can actually hear me when I talk that's all but I think I think I am I'm at the point in my streaming setup that it is fine bro what the fuck's little Timmy doing yeah it does lower a bit that's all I care about as long as the fucking as long as the ducking actually works it's fine you're usually you're able to hear it especially in bug fables um the hell Timmy 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 no Timmy no Timmy please I beg of you nah he's chill no Timmy he's going away Timmy's going to the sea in the sky and there he goes. There he goes, Timmy. Okay, chat, say bye to Timmy. When Timmy despawns is when, when I'm stopping the stream. No, Tim, Timmy's moving on to greener pastures, chat. You guys have to calm your tits. Come on. It's okay. 
Uh, the stream has been great, especially after an unfun past week and an even worse one coming back. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear about that, Doctor. I really am. I Trust me, I've had my fair share of a rough week last week, so... I hope... I hope you do good. Okay, here. Anyway, I think we got a new duck. <laughs> Timmy's fine. Timmy's fine, chat. He's okay. You guys are a bunch of empty nesters, I swear to God. What do we have this time? <gasps> is that a cow? I believe that is a cow. Or that or it's just a polka dot. Polka dot man. Hey, yeah, what are we calling this one? Our child, we named it! Who do we have left? Who do we have left to name? Uh, We don't really have a green duck yet. Panda? The baby duck? That's a panda? Bam, okay. The spot. <laughs> the spot. I like spot. Spots. He's got two spots on his eyes. Two spots. Two. Count them. Two. Pain? We could call it pain. I don't know if that's pinata. Honestly, if anybody's pinata, it's the... Oh. Oh my god, I have such a weird thing where, like, my finger slips and I hit the fucking slash. There you go, piñata. That one fits. I went to the hat store today and I bought myself a hat. Let's watch Yellow Granite fuck for a bit. Oh my god, I just noticed the Wasp King's name for the wooden duck. You can thank Angry Artist for that. That was his idea. Check in on Tim. Uh... Chat, we can't check on Tim anymore. Tim, Timmy is gone. Oh wait, the duck's repopulated. I saw that. Wait, there were baby ducks somewhere. I saw that. Look at that, they're f little babies. Sex was had. Someone had sex, that's awesome. We support that. Oh, bye Eli. <laughs> Timmy died. No. Timmy escapes your guys' peripheral vision for like five seconds and you guys just immediately think he's dead. Timmy literally- you can't have eyes on Timmy forever. You know, Timmy has to live his own life. He's living his own life, guys. I'm not gonna be a fucking helicopter parent like you guys want me to. I'm gonna let my baby boy- I'm gonna let my baby boy experience life the way he wants to experience it. Timmy's communicator, wait out, we can't reach it. This is not a sex moment, Narwhal. Timmy is dead. <laughs> Damn. F's in the chat for... He went out to the ocean and... He's a duck! He floats in the ocean. He'll be fine. Again, it's just... he just We just can't see him. Chat, you guys are going to have a kid. He's going to go to, like, his friend's house for the night, and you guys are going to be terrified out of your ass you'll think he's dead he's like oh he went to like jeremy's for the afternoon oh no he's fucking dead i can't i can't see him with my own two eyes that must mean he ceases to be i got back once again and this bug fables update looks crazy it is yeah no, i didn't think they'd go this far in the new bug fables but like it was an interesting choice i feel you know i'm, I'm, I'm not against it you know i'm not like you know, it's not the worst. Definitely wasn't what I expected. Also, the flamingo was so fucking close. And Timmy and Sans did it together, then Timmy left. It's not that we can't see him, it's that he isn't answering our calls and doesn't want to talk to us. Okay, well that clearly shows that you were a bad parent. He talks to me all the time, but you don't see me fucking crying. I just like keeping that shit to myself. Timmy grew up too fast. Kerbazoid abandoned him at- Oh, okay. Okay, Emerald. Alright, Emerald. You guys are just- Now you're just- Now you're just throwing blows. You're just mad that our child only talks to me and only wants to hang out with me because I actually allow him to be his own duck. That's on you, chat. That is on you. 
Where did those 30 seconds go with Timmy? Oh. Ooh, plaid duck. Plaid duck. I like him. Your name is O'Grady. You're O'Grady. Kerbazoid, we trusted you. Yeah. I, yeah, just tell, just as much as I entrust myself with the safety of my duck child. And, you know, sometimes you have to let the duck child live their own life. Y'all are making a mountain out of a molehill for something you don't even know is happening. You guys are like literally anybody who tries to parrot someone on Twitter. How fucking dare you? I'm not a helicopter parent. I was excited to see him go on his own adventure. Uh, clearly not. Y'all are fucking malding right now. That's insane. What if little Timmy is transgender and named Little Jilly? Then we fully support them in their endeavor, and we entrust them to, to make the right decisions for themselves. You took the kids. Yeah. Because they liked me more, and I was actually wanting to support them. The court doesn't make those... <laughs> the court does not make those judgments willy-nilly. They made the informed, ju the informed and, uh, dare I say, correct judgment that I would actually take care of the kids while y'all just fucking show up once a week. I have to actually take care of him day to day. Don't act like you deserve custody of our boy. That's why he left. He doesn't he doesn't feel proud being in your presence. If it was just me and Timmy, he would he would be fine. He would still be in the pool right now. He'd be chilling. This is a kidnapping. He ran away. This is not a kidnapping. He literally chose to leave on his own accord. You're just mad because he doesn't like you. This turned from bug fables to a divorce segment. Yeah. Well, you're just mad I won the settlement. Because of me? Man, way to, way to deflect, man. That's insane. That's insane, man. What game is this? I don't know. Does that say baller ass? Yeah. Wait, let's find baller ass. Where's baller ass? Where's baller ass? There's baller ass. There he is. That's baller ass. He's got, he's baller ass. What do you mean? What is this game called? It's called Placid 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 Plastic Duck Simulator. Here's Yellow Granite Fuck. Yellow Granite Fuck's actually kind of... This guy's my favorite, probably. I like Yellow Granite Fuck. I think he's my personal favorite. Suck Simu... No. 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 <laughs> Poor Jilly comes from a broken home. Guys, listen, Timmy was too old. We have three younger ducks in the round pool, so don't worry about Timmy. He's okay. Curb, you don't even let us see our kids. We care about them. We love them. We would see them more, but you don't let it. What do you think this is right now? Literally, I'm giving you the opportunity to spend time with your children. And all you're like, you're taking this opportunity that I am graciously giving you to spend time with our children. And all you are doing is complaining to us. You are literally wasting the time that you are graciously allowed to spend with our children. And you're only using that time to yell at me. You guys are all fucking... This is why I have access to the kids. You're telling us he ran away, you liar. No, he ran away because he doesn't want to bear with your bitching. That is how that works. You're just mad that literally all of our, what, 30, what, 10, like 10, 20 children now? They're all just hanging out with me now because I'm chill. I actually provide for them, and if they were in your hands, they would just leave and come crawling back to me. That's just how it works. I was just worried about Timmy. Is he okay? I just want to make sure- He's fine! If he wasn't fine, I, would, I wouldn't have the faith in him to just be completely chill about him leaving for the pool. Or leaving the pool. If he was in a dangerous situation, I would be worried about him. But am I worried as his primary caregiver? No, I, I trust that he knows what he's doing. And if he ever needs help, he's more than willing to come talk to me or you, depending on who he picks. It's just I have the, uh, the opinion that he would most likely talk to me first. Anyway, we have the rock now. We have boulder. That's my boulder. Bullduck. There. Well, he did fall out into the ocean. That's pretty dangerous. There's sharks everywhere, and he probably can't call for help. He literally has a phone. 
But of course you wouldn't know that because you don't pay for the bill. I have to pay for the phone bill. I have to pay for the phone bill of not only Timmy, who is a fully grown adult, but I pay for the phone bill of all of our other children. You, whenever I try to ask you to pay for the bill, you seem to magically have something better to do and walk away. Holy crap, screw Timmy, guys. Look at the bulldog. Gab, his phone went out. He can't call out. He can't call us. No, he chooses not to call you. Christ. You never asked us about the... Yeah, okay, now... Okay, see, and... You guys are complaining way too much. Look, again... You never asked us about the bill. You know why I don't? The more bills I pay, the more assured the government knows. The, the more assured the government feels knowing that I am the superior caregiver of our children. And clearly, Bullduck would never be happier. He, he, can, he is physically incapable of being any happier than where he is right now. Bulldog is the most reliable child. He just takes all the rest of the family shit and is an he is an amazing listener. He takes after me. Clearly not from you, but it's fine. We are funding the bill anyway with these subscriptions. Uh, we? <laughs> I'm pretty sure yours was gifted, <laughs> doodle. Maybe not. I could be wrong, but... You're just like my dad. Hey, I'm out of this. I'm just a gold duck chillin'. That's fair. Let's get these fucking cinematic angles of Mad Mud Duck, bro. I didn't think this is where the the finale stream would go, by the way. I didn't think this is where my life would... Just like my life in general would go, you know? I need to go to bed. <laughs> oh, double negative, so I cancelled out. So I'm positive now. Cool. Yellow Granite Fuck is my personal favorite. Yes, Rock Polish. Someone fucking gets it. Clearly... Clearly, someone in our chat understands who the favorite child is. We need art of little Timmy slash Jilly. I like little Timmy. Little Timmy is is the child that, you know, he's independent. He's a fucking lone wolf. He does what he wants. And the fact you guys are so worried about it shows that you might need to take some parenting, you might need to talk to a therapist about, bring back Timmy. Bro, you clearly need to go to a therapist about your empty nester feelings. I have had, I have dealt with my mo emotions well enough to understand that Timmy is now a full adult and he left the nest. I understand that it is now my duty to take that care and distribute it equally to the rest of my children. Thank you very much. Bring him back. Cap, stop calling him Little Timmy. He isn't little anymore. He's little to me, damn it. He came out of... You know, he... I'm, I don't know where he... I, do you guys know where Little Timmy came from? I don't want to, like, state a fact that I don't understand. How did we make these children chat? How, now I'm asking questions. Now I'm asking now I'm asking the real questions, chat, I feel. Also, we're gonna get a new child soon, wherever the hell they come from, but He spawned from the sky. Ah. You're dead naming him, he's big Timmy. Okay, let's That's a reach. <laughs> That's a reach. I understand you're not making it that deep. I assure you, it's not that deep. Eight. Agent eight. It's agent eight. Uh. Octo. Expansion. Trademark. We used the souls of all the enemies we killed during the Bug Fable streams to summon these guys? Ah. So would, would, uh, would Timmy... Would, would Timmy's soul be one of, like, the golden seedlings because he was off to run away? He's the only one that made an escape, and the only ones that make an escape from me are the golden seedlings when I'm bad. 
Gab, you could end the stream after the pink flamingo part. Floaty joins the pool part. Okay. I mean, like, I should probably just end the stream now. It's like one in the morning. <laughs> There you go. Ugh. Good stream. Good stream, everybody. Ate that. Oh, God. My back. Not in front of the kid. You're the one who brought this up, bastard. Don't don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. I'm going to spend time with my duck children uh, far out of your fucking radius of hatred, my friend. You are a bad vibe and a bad influence to our children. Therefore, that is why the, the court... The court of law has offered me full custody of the kids. You're lucky that I even offer you, like, one day of seeing them. Little Timmy was 100% a golden seedling, and yellow granite fuck is definitely a B33. <laughs> he was so close to- I don't care. I want to go to bed. I want to sleep. At least I'll still be there in duck form. Yeah. You're our golden child, Eli. You're the one that's always there, and your value is exponential. Boycott? Alright. You take- you try attempting to take the kids once, and then the law is just gonna see you as, like, an even less fitting parent, so... I win regardless. I'm just talking to the kids now. Do you know that Sans is trying to be a golf professional? Honestly, he has not told me that. But I'm happy that he, you know, because sometimes you don't tell your parents everything, you know, and that's fine. That's fine. I'm happy that he's, you know, he's he's taking time out of his life to communicate with you guys. That shows that they really do want to care. They really do care about you. You should not take that lightly. Am I valued? Yes, Subby. Otherwise, your name would not be Subby based. You were lit like you were literally my favorite. You like your care your duck was my favorite design wise. So, if that makes anything, oh, perfect music to end off with. It actually is. Why did Timmy leave your pool then? Well, clearly he didn't join yours. You were panicking so much. That's like. Also, you understand that children can grow up, right? They don't stay in my house forever. So. I see why they call you the angry artist. How do you know? How the fuck do you know, man? Jeez. They are ducks. Well, clearly this is why I... I have full visit it, like... Yeah. You're, now you're just devaluing our children. Now you know why we got divorced, because clearly... You show no value to our children's lives, and yet you so blatantly want to they are ducks ducks okay and this is why i have custody this is why i have custody because clearly the other side was a very easy side to win against uh, but there we go there we go all right uh, uh weird duck marriage rp aside uh, i'm i need to go to bed i'm really fucking tired <laughs> poopy fate well now it's just a low blow <laughs> I gotta go to sleep. Thank you, everybody. Uh, on f uh, I, I will see what I can do on Monday. I work Tuesday, so I will do a short stream on Monday. We might do a liao. We might do something else. I don't know. I just know that uh, Friday we will start... Potentially we will start um, Citizen Sleeper. Depends on the mood. Monday we might do something for, for the anniversary. We, we, we might revisit... Um, Honestly, we might revisit Kirby in the Forgotten Land or something. Eh, something. Divorce aside, I hope you have a nice weekend. See? Now that's a good sport. That's a good sport. Biden cart? No offense. I get... I admittedly get heated at Biden cart. That's not the vibe I want to bring into the world anymore. I'm good. I'm happy that Biden cart was a fun joke for a while. Honestly, we might bring back Metopia me making. Honestly. I would be down for that, actually. But... Only time will tell. Only time will tell. Uh, look out for the uh, Cult of the Lamb episode 1. For everybody that isn't a member, uh, that'll launch Tuesday at 5pm CST. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, the next time I see ya, I will see ya. Bleh.